Hi, everybody. Hello. Welcome to the stream. I'm so glad that this weekend I was really busy because I had zero time to think about this game. <laughs> I didn't get to think about it much, so it went, it was actually really, really great. <laughs> I'm really thankful that I was busy to distract me. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. Uh, oh, I didn't change the title on Twitch, did I? Oh, I suck. Uh, chapter five time. All right, I did the Pang Me Club, doing my job. And we're on chapter five. I can't take this game. That's the title. I can't take this game. Okay. I did it. I should have done that before I started. But whatever, we're here now. <laughs> Hello! It's Monday, everybody! All right, I am here now. Hello, Bliss. Welcome, everybody. Good morning, good morning. Oh, also, um, so one thing that's happening today is the Persona 5 Tactica video is finally coming out after a, a long wait, which is totally fine. But it is also the last video that our lovely friend Dina is editing for the channel. Dina is moving on. She's got university and life to deal with. You know, it's a lot for her to do it right now. She wants to really focus on studies. So Dean, this is like Dina's last video that she's editing for the channel before she uh, moved on. And I'm so sad. She said she she sent me the video this morning, and I was like, "This is such a good video for Dina to go out on because it was it was because of Persona Five. Like, Dina made parody videos of my videos, which is why I hired her in the first place. Uh, and it was because of her love for Akechi. So to finish it with like Persona Five Tactica just felt so fitting for that her to be that to be her last video. <laughs> She's been so great. So yeah, emotional morning. But the Persona 5 Tactica video is coming out at 11, so in an hour here. And then you guys can watch Dina's final, final video edit. And I hope you guys like it. We're gonna miss Dina a lot. She's such a gamer. <clears throat> oh, you know, we're doing good. <laughs> I filmed my Yukari dance video. And it will be live this weekend. I'm planning on launching the video probably Friday or Saturday. I'm not sure. It kind of depends. I'm waiting on the thumbnail. But I actually already finished editing the dance part of the video, which is a lot. <laughs> I can't believe I managed to do that in one day. That's the fastest I've ever edited a dance video. So yeah, you'll have a Yukari dance video on Saturday. You have a special Persona 3 Reload, or no, uh, just Persona 3, You Laugh, You Lose special on Wednesday with a special guest that you guys are sure that don't exist, but whatever. We got a lot. We got a lot of uh, fun stuff. New CP, I know. Oh my God, new PC made me pop off. This is my first dance video I've edited on my new PC. And let me tell you how much of a big different difference it makes. Also, the fact that, so every Sunday night, I play Baldur's Gate 3 with my group, right? And I wanted to edit while playing the game. And I could not do that on my old PC because my computer would crash. I was able to play Baldur's Gate 3 and edit my dance video at the same time. Oh! <laughs> And, and nothing crashed. Everything worked amazingly. I was like, holy crap, I can play Baldur's Gate 3 on maximum graphics and I can edit a dance video at the same time. I, uh, I was ecstatic. I was like doing this on two different monitors and I, I was I was like, oh my God, no frame skipping. Nothing is like slowing down. I was even on Discord video chat at the same time and my camera wasn't frame skipping. Like everything was running on max potential. I w that was like, that is like the sexiest thing my PC has ever done. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that was really awesome. 
I got to really test the power of my PC yesterday and it was fantastic. Also, yeah, I totally agree with you. People aren't real. Oh, I need to pin that message. Thank you so much, Diane. Because, yeah, that was, the, that was the thing I wanted to do was, like, I want to be able to edit videos while I'm doing other things. But a lot of times I only could edit videos and only edit videos because my computer could barely handle to do anything else before. So that really is a game changer that I can edit videos and have it be completely smooth without... Um, and, 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 like, while doing something else. That was such a big difference. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Alan. I appreciate that. Yo, no memory card. Welcome. Yeah, exactly. New PCs, like, do whatever you want. And I'm like, hell yes. Thank you. I will. I will do whatever I want. <laughs> Playing a game and video editing. Well, Baldur's Gate 3 is a little, little bit different when you play multiplayer because, like, whenever I'm waiting in combat for my friends to go, because it is, like, semi-turn-based, you know, so if I'm, like, waiting in combat, if I'm watching or dialogue, I can edit while scenes are running, and then I can also edit while combat is going, so. Not whenever so much we're exploring, but there's a lot of, like, downtime when you have multiplayer and you have like a full group of four people playing Baldur's Gate 3, so. Yeah, I have a lot of downtime. I, I was able to almost finish editing my dancing video whenever we were playing, so it was really awesome. <clears throat> what CPU did you go for? That is a good question. I don't, I, I updated my website with my PC specs, but I don't know where else I listed my PC specs. I think they are on my website though, if you wanna know. There's like a, there's a Twitch tab and all of my specs are there. <clears throat> Multitasking editing is required. Dude, it is. Oh my God. Even just something as simple as watching a YouTube video on the side while editing, like watching a show. Uh, I It was really hard for me to do that on my old PC. So yeah, this is amazing. <clears throat> You're trying to play Infinite Wealth, P3R, and FF14 at the same time, bro. You need to pick one. Well, you're really close to the end of Heaven's Word, so I would say, like, you know, just gun that out. Just, just get it done, you're almost there, and you have a good stopping point. But, like, Infinite Wealth months. might take you longer, and then I would wait on Persona 3 personally, but it's also really hard to, like, not be on that hype train. Like, it, it kills my insides to not be playing Persona 3 Reload right now. I want to be playing it, but I gotta wait. Gideon! Thank you so much for the six months resub, I appreciate it. Your girlfriend got you a new keyboard for your anniversary. Oh, damn. I think I want to look into a new keyboard soon. I I never really liked it. It's been five years, six years since I've had it, but I never really liked it. But I just don't know what model I want. I end up cramming them all together. Dude, you're insane. You've been stuck in the batting cages for four hours? Now you could stay there for a lot more hours. You got this. <clears throat> and tonight I'm playing some Ace Attorney. Bro. Don't bring up Ace Attorney in my presence. I might, I might die. You ordered a physical copy of PPR and it's killing you that everyone that downloaded right, is already I'm playing it. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, when you have to like awkwardly wait when you buy like collector's edition type stuff for physical copies, it's awful. Also, raise your horn! What the heck? Thank you so much for gifting two subs to the community! That is very kind of you, thank you. Aww. You made uh, a... Oh, you're trying to finish Infinite Wealth before P3 
P3R. Yeah, that is... That's, I think, the play, because I, I, I have a hard time playing two games at the same time nowadays. I used to stream two games at the same time, and I realized how much of a detriment that was. I don't know. It, there, was, there was pros and cons, but I feel like for me there were more cons than there were pros with that process. But yeah, I, I really just like one game at a time right now. I feel like I miss out when you when you're playing two games at the same time. Like I have a hard time remembering uh, some plot points, and I get them mixed up with the other game that I'm playing, and I don't want to miss out on things in the story because my brain is just not that big. <laughs> I can't I can't do that as much. <clears throat> You're under agreement with myself to always play a new Like a Dragon game to the end before playing anything else. Yes, that's exactly what you should be doing. You're doing it right. <clears throat> you don't have the courage to finish the game? Yeah, that's me right now. I don't want to finish this game. I'm also scared to continue playing the game because it's just already breaking my heart. I just... I don't know if I have the stomach to finish the game. Every time I do plot now, I'm a little bit scared. It's really bad. I am fairly confident that we can finish this game before FF7 Rebirth, though. I think we have like three weeks. One, two, three weeks. Yeah. Yeah. I, we can definitely finish this game beforehand. That's the goal. I'm addicted and I hate playing multiple games at the same time. Yeah. I'm glad that you're addicted though. This game is way too fun. <clears throat> I don't know how long the game is, so I have no clue if I'm close to the end or not. Same, and I don't want to know how long this game is either. I really don't want to know. Just don't, just don't care to know, dude. I'm gonna be playing Infinite Well for a while though, and I fully intend on doing everything I possibly can in this game too. I, that's just it. We're doing everything that is possible. Every substory, every mini game. Well, I'm trying to play the mini games off stream, but um, yeah, just I, I'm doing as much as I can. I can't wait for you to advance. Oh, I don't know if we're gonna be advancing for a while. <laughs> Every time you get to a new chapter, you get a whole bunch of sub-stories. So I'm like, oh, are we really going to do plot today? Because I just got to chapter 5, so I'm like, uh, probably going to be a lot of sub-stories. <laughs> probably. <clears throat> Playing multiple games messes up your, your skeep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same. It's really rough. Yeah, no, I cannot believe they're doing an, uh, a state of play, or like, yeah, a rebirth state of play tomorrow. No! <laughs> they have so much footage of this fucking game out, I feel like it's just a giant waste of time and money. My god. I feel like at this point, people are decided whether they're buying the game or not, and I don't know how this state of play is going to make somebody buy the game now. Like, I don't- it just seems like a giant waste. Not to mention releasing more footage about the game when they already put out a majority of the game already. It's so cool. <clears throat> oh, I did get Sujimon off stream. Yes. And I unlocked the first member of the Elite Four, Discreet Four. Uh, so yes, I'll be doing the sub stories on stream. So I'm like playing Sujimon off stream, but when it comes to advancing sub story plot stuff, I'm doing that on stream. So today we're gonna do the discrete four. Um, well, the first guy, because I unlocked that sub story. That's it though. So yeah, still playing. I'm like, uh, I've been, I've been uh, collecting my Sujimons. Okay, I've been filling up the Suji decks pretty well. I did, I played for like two hours on Saturday. That's it. So I didn't get to play too much, but it was enough to get like a pretty decent amount of Sujimon. 
You haven't even touched the Sujimon stuff? What are you doing? <clears throat> Favorite sub story so far? No, I do not. There's a lot of good ones, though, this time around. Holy shit. There's so much content in this game. Let me tell you that this game is actually worth $70. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> Except not the other stuff, but it's worth $70. It's fun and simple. Yeah, whenever I was doing some Sujimon battles, like, I appreciated that it didn't take too much of my time. Like, it's, it's a, it's, it's simple enough, but fun enough at the same time. It has a really good balance to it. I did drop Pokemon. You know what? But Sujimon, whole new game, whole new game. <clears throat> they went too hard on emotional ones and they're less goofy ones. Uh, I'm gonna disagree with you on that one so far. Like, they've been equally half and half emotional. And that's been every Yakuza game. Every Yakuza, Yakuza game I've played, they've like half and half. You have like 50% emotional, 50% goofy, and then you have like emotional and goofy ones, and I feel like it's just been very equal. It doesn't feel any different to the other Yakuza games for me, and how the other sub-stories are. <clears throat> yeah, with the amount of polished content, god, Yakuza is incredible. Like, not only do these games deliver an insane story, like, just playing the story, and you're gonna have a good time, but you also get fully flushed out mini-games, and a whole new town, this like whole new Honolulu map that we get this time around with so much freaking stuff. Holy crap, they filled this place out so much. It is insane. Oh, this is so filled with content. Boops, Jadon, thank you so much for 55 freaking months. That is so long. Thank you. Hmm. <clears throat> Well, they worked on these games at the same time, too, so... Uh, Infinite Wealth has been in development for a while. <laughs> the map is so dense, it is. There's so much stuff. <clears throat> There's so much content. There is an insane amount of content. The fact that they made Gaiden in six months is crazy. It's so hard to believe, honestly. It says a lot when I'm still playing super crazy delivery when I have nothing left to do, left to gain from it. It's just fun. It is really fun. It is really fun. I think I also got all the rewards for it, but you do get money out of it. You could trade the points for just straight up cash. So I mean, at least you're you're gaining something. games characters all the side content yeah it's a full-fledged rpg you're not just playing an rpg for the story side of it but there is equal amounts of content outside of the main story than there is the main story which is not very typical for your regular jrpg that you're playing usually your regular jrpg is like 90 percent main story and 10 percent side content it's a lot like the percentage is a lot less but with Yakuza, it's like usually 20, 30% main story. And then you have like 70% side stuff that you can do. It's crazy. But I love that. That, that attention to side content detail is so fun and so unique. <clears throat> you think they'll reuse Hawaii for future game? I, how, how can I tell you that? I didn't finish the game. It depends on the plot. <laughs> It, it, the, the answer to that question is heavily reliant on where the plot takes us in this game. <clears throat> I 
Oh, I actually didn't check how many gigs this game was. Is it 90 gigs? That's not bad. I didn't know that. I should have checked it whenever I downloaded it off of Steam, but I did not. I didn't check how much space there was. <clears throat> you have some co-workers on your overnight shift that have been wanting to try something new and I heavily always recommend the Yakuza games. Yes. You're doing your part. I'm so proud. Uh, hello, you're hopping in the stream since you're almost planning the game. Oh my god, dude. Hardcore. But yeah, welcome to the stream. We'll see if we get to a lot of story today. We'll see. We'll see. We just started chapter five, so we're not very far into... We, yeah, just started chapter five. <clears throat> It's 54 gigs on PS5. How did they do that? That's crazy. Woo. You only have 128 gigs on your laptop? Oh no. Thankfully, I think my laptop has either one or two terabytes. I'm not sure. I think it might be one terabyte though. My PCs, this PC's SSD only has a one terabyte. But I do, the thing is, like, I, when I download games, I don't keep them on my computer. As soon as I'm done playing a game, I delete it. Like, I uninstall it. Because I know it's cloud. It's cloud saved anyway. So I don't see a reason to keep it on my computer. If I want to play the game again, I just re-download it. Simple as that. I, I always, like, try to keep my PC, like, as free as possible. Half of the storage is actually taken up just by Kimi's ass. I don't know what to say to that. <laughs> 72 gigs in modern gaming is small, yes. Because modern games, like with, with the amount of like graphics that you have in today's genre of gaming, 72 is pretty small. <clears throat> <laughs> We're at the start of chapter five right now. I also, yeah, the super crazy delivery. I did finish that game. I don't know if I, I didn't get all the rewards, but I did get the ones at least that I cared about, that I cared to have. Yeah, we can get started today. Rebirth being 150 gigs. Yeah, I am I question that amount of gigs, but it's okay. That seems like a bit much. Game better be big. That's all I'm saying. It's all those graphics, man. The graphics taking up so much gigs. Hmm. <clears throat> No, this game will never end. Don't say that. This game this game doesn't have an ending. <laughs> Don't say that. It'll just never end. <sighs> Alright, so, like I said before, I advanced the Sujimon plot, so I have to head to Jack's hideout. This is the Elite Four guy. Discreet for, sorry. So I can challenge him. I think I might start the stream off like that, but I'm also interested in hearing more about Chitose. So I might stop at some of these like uh, talking spots. And what we should do along the ride, since it's a new chapter, we have more segues to listen to. Now we have five. I didn't listen to four either, I think. We didn't listen to four? Well, we're gonna find out. <clears throat> I can turn that off, right? Okay, so if I hold L1... Alright, here we go! Here's how you start the stream. 
Captain Mike Hula and first mate DJ KB Stu shoving off on another voyage. Heave ho! Time to hoist it. Did he just say he ho? Hey, put me down! Put me down, man! Jeez! Oh, Mike! How much more did you eat last night? Not enough to stop you from He ho! Anyway, folks, glad you made it just in time for Seg Waves. Peep you. See what's the plan? Last I checked, the next episode's Hot Spots Part Two. Don't say it. Honolulu Boogaloo. He said it. He had Honolulu Boogaloo. I remember we talked about some things to do east of Aloha Bridge. Now let's boogie on over to the other end. See what I did there? Honolulu boogie. Okay. So what's the first thing someone might want to do when they reach the west side? Uh, steer clear of District Five. Uh, but yeah. Aloha. Steer clear District Five. Yeah. Well, then it's gotta be Anaconda, huh? Yeah, definitely a sight to see. For those who haven't been there, either because they haven't been or they walk around staring at their phone, the Anaconda Shopping Center is a gorgeous open-air mall that attracts visitors from all around a the rumor? world. It's got fashion. It's got oh. food. All kinds of seasonal events. Mm -hmm. Oh, seasonal events! Anaconda. <laughs> right. An arcade you can easily fit inside this studio. Yeah, as long as it's got Virtua Stop Fighter, up. who's mm -hmm. complaining? You know oh, Virtua you Fighter, play? yeah. I did not know that you played. You up for a round or two after the show? Mm, sorry, Mike. You're ten y years too early. Oh, okay. Yep, yep. Walked right into that one. Walked right into it. Okay. <laughs> and if you want to walk some more, there's always Anaconda Harbor Park right across the street from the parking lot. Oh, okay. Sunset. Wait. I have to. I want to make sure I know what they're talking about. So that's Anaconda Boulevard, Anacara, yeah, Anaconda Park, and then the shopping center. That's fucking massive. Okay. Fishing. Run into some bad guys. Run into some bad guys. You. They don't. You want to know why? Wouldn't oh, I want to beat these guys up. Amulets. You having a stroke? I want to beat them up. What? Come again? Well, I mean, I don't know how it works or whatever it, it is, but it's this thing. That my wife got me to set it to keep me out of trouble. I have no idea where she got it from. Oh, you're a lucky man, Big Mike. To have your lady looking out for you like that. Oh, and I want to beat up those guys I too. Know, God damn it. Dolls and Devil's Playhouse. We found that place. You really took the boys out to Night Square. I did. Yeah, I did. What? I did. What? How come I wasn't invited? Look, what? You're the first one there and the last one to leave. You were drinking like a fish. How can you not remember this? <laughs> we was both drinking like a fish. There we were. Uh, memory like one too. <laughs> yeah, right. Anyway. Hey. Might as well give our listeners a rundown. Oh, so, uh, Night Square's a stone's throw away from Anaconda, and as the name implies, it's all about the, uh, <laughs> nightlife entertainment. If you know nightlife. Ooh. Air quotes with my fingers. Mm, I think I'm picking up what you're laying down. That's right. From Mr. Tingles to vivacious video, it's got everything you need when you turn 21 and want to make your mama or significant other cry. That's yeah. true. Or, or your creator. I mean, I can't imagine that the, uh, big kahuna upstairs did all that work just to watch you walk into a place called... Hyper ecstasy, which hyper by the way, ecstasy. Is not as ecstatic as it's Can I awesome fish while listening? Inside, no, 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 but I've heard <laughs> things. On yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. Internet. We all heard the things. The internet. It was the yes! internet. Yes! It was the internet. I can I fish while listening. This is amazing. Hey, true, true. <laughs> Place that winds up getting blessed by a volcano oh vo volcano tattoo you ever been no i don't do tattoos they're uh, they're out of the questions i like i like my uh i like my hot springs pee pee say what <laughs> i mean in in japan they don't let you in the hot Sweet. springs with a tattoo they're afraid it's a sign of the uh yakuza huh? yeah no I mean, yakuza on hot springs yakuza, like but what if you're a yakuza yeah, member and you want to go to a hot spring do you have to go to a you know? special one you know what uh, i mean it could be could be really anything i doubt completely though that they actually spell out Yakuza on the, on the chat <laughs> or on the back but in as much as I don't read Japanese characters it, it is entirely possible so what, what I'm saying though is that uh, it, it, since your guess is as good as mine you, you know what's good got really good art though oh you know what I'm gonna steal your thunder here the art walls yes indeed art <laughs> food sweet good atmosphere here and you don't have to be a hipster to enjoy it it's 
Ah, doll in the spirit of Aloha. People expressing the spirit of Aloha. Interpreting how we look at things. Yes. As long as it's not obscene or, you know, obscene in the wrong way, I, I think it's okay. You know that it's deep. It's very deep, PP. I didn't, I didn't think you were capable of such thoughts as deep and involved in that. You know? <laughs> but I am very proud of you. I feel like we've, we've grown together. We have. As long as that self expression isn't improved. You know, before the alt wall, art wall had art, it had, Sweet. Uh, um, what's that uh, stuff? The, the dirt. Dirt, yes. Not a whole lot else. Nope, and uh, some changes for the better. And some things need to stay right the way they are. I'm talking about Chinatown, of course. You don't think it needs pop art every square inch? Psh, nah. I mean, wow. if a who understands the place wants to add their own spin, I say go for it. But part of why I like Chinatown is it's not trying to be anything new or different. It's old, it's weather, it's season, and it's proud of what it is. Yes, a lot like the country of China itself. And a bit like us. Isn't that so? Uh, I was going to say like you, but if you say also so. true. Manga? I'm very old. Wait. Very old. And Whoa! Season. I almost got hit by a car. <laughs> One ukulele chord, brada, the ukulele. Oh, yeah, there it is. It's our time to talk story. Now, to be honest, I think I'm all talked out. You got anything for us, uh, PP, we haven't already talked about? PP to the rescue. Oh, you. friend. Ah, all right, let's see. Uh, Aloha. No, Aloha. I got nothing. Huh. Rare to see you running on empty. Tell me about it. Normally, I'm running around at the speed of sound. Wait, is you know, this the next one? Oh, no, this is still episode four. to see you run that fast. Yeah. Psychedelic coffee's down the street, bro. That's a good point. Lord knows I could do some caffeine myself. How long has this coffee machine been broken? <laughs> uh, right. Is the company supposed to maintain it? They keep telling us to wait for the new office. Oh, how many times we heard that? I couldn't even count it, but maybe we should stop upsetting the powers that be. Uh, listen, uh, take my lead. I'd rather not be set free. You know what I'm saying? It's the getting fired. I still like having a show. True. Live and learn, I guess. Alrighty, folks, if we're here at the same time tomorrow, you can assume that we're in the clear. And if not, seg waves with PP Stew on the web and come check out my new podcast. Hey, what about me? Ah, you can be the guy who gets the coffee. <laughs> okay. Oh, right. wow. Well, thanks for tuning into our show. For more I like this show. I hope the they keep it going. The speakers playing K Lulu FM, and we'll see you on the flip side, brothers. See you on the flip side, brothers. Hell yes. Hey, they've got Japanese manga here in English. It's even got a new cover. <gasps> That's kind of cool. This stuff is popular over here. They show anime on TV too. Wow, I didn't know. You read any of these, Tomi? Well, you know, a few. They make decent conversation starters. And adds a caddy. That right? Oh. So much thought? detail. Of course, gotta be careful of the Japanese clients in that case. They're up on the latest chapters. And they'll spoil you on them. Talk about a road hazard. Super. <laughs> I love how generic this is. Oh, look. They sell comics. They even have Japanese manga. Oh, interesting how they changed the covers. Gives the book a different vibe. Dude, oh, comics. New story. Comics. Superhero yes. comic book. What I like book. is downloading digital manga that's gone out of print. That way I can read as much as I want anytime. What an age to be alive. If you say so, old timer. But say, uh, anything you'd recommend? Uh, let's see. As far as ebooks go, I like this one here. Oh, and this one too. Hmm. Chichan, these are all kids' comics. Nothing but gags and fart jokes. Uh, uh, well, yeah, so what? They're funny. What's wrong with wanting to laugh? Oh, no, no, no. I I love this stuff. Say? I had no idea this series was still going. <gasps> he understands. We're really <laughs> opening up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hey, aloha. Hula Mike's running late today, so I'm taking He understands. <laughs> Yo, what the heck? Expert, thank you for okay, the $20 okay. donation, dude. I really appreciate that. Oh, there it is. No, there's the alert. It takes so long to pop up for YouTube. Thank you so much, though. Really appreciate it.
appreciate it. Thank you for the support. Look at this diver. He looks so dorky. Uh-oh. We should kill that guy. Oh, damn. Disarming fragrance. Uh. Designer perfume, lowering the attack of her enemies. Okay. Stay back. Come on. I can bless. Catch of the day. <laughs> he slapped a fish in my face. It's fucked up. Oh, that's depressing. Come on, hot shot. No, he's dead. Let's go. How do you want to die? Just a second. I love the design of this shadow diver. Yeah. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I really wish you could just throw them into the river. Oh, Follow my lead. Man. Oh wow, the follow-up, okay. Cool. I'm like, maybe if I corner him enough, he'll get thrown okay. into the river. Can we get those two in an actual podcast? Because I would listen to every episode. It's really enjoyable. So that's that's even more content that RGG managed to do in this game, by the way. They managed to create an entire really entertaining podcast for this game. You know how hard it is to make a podcast first try? How did they do this? In fact, I got a special guest with me off the I am thinking about it, yeah. I, I'm hoping that Chitose grows on me more and more over, over the game. Because uh, I would like to recreate her moves and cosplay her. But I only, yeah, like I said before, I only do that for characters that I like. So, uh, I do like her right now, but I want to, you know, I want to love her. And plus, I don't trust her. I feel like she's going to double cross me. You just hold still now. Want some? Ow. Let's get this over with. I just realized that, like, I'm kind of dying. Chitose's health is a little bit in danger. There's the one that they didn't translate. Yeah, unfortunately. I need a break. Poor Chitose is like actually dying over here. Oh, she got a level up, so I don't need to heal her. Perfect. See, that was completely calculated. Oh, Jesus. I was caught in the middle. I was so excited to listen to my podcast. Damn it. It feels like they gave the English ones a better podcast. Um, maybe it could also be because like it's set in Hawaii, English country. I don't know. I'm hoping that someone makes a video of like uh, translating the Japanese podcast. That'd be nice. I'm sure someone maybe already did it. 
Yeah, I would read. I would read a translation of what they say in the podcast. Should I open it? More than Mary, your pilot on the plate, cuz. You, know, you could have waited. Hey, mm. I could have been a contender, too. <laughs> so, what do we got? What, what else? There's so many things <laughs> in this book. So me much weed. <laughs> okay, all right, here we go. First up, we got. Um, Should I open it? Sure, you guessed. We got one of my Your personal face, favorite. Hold on. Let me see if that's like. Um... So, I have a steel frame. I mean. It probably might be better though if uh, I upgrade it. Lowering enemy defense is really good. Hawaiian staples, the trifecta of seaweed. I'll sue you. That was awkward. Okay. You asked for it. Nameless. Okay, that's creepy. What's the hold up? More herbs in a room before Resident <laughs> Evil boss fight. That's true. <laughs> okay, you were supposed to go the other way. He's gonna burn to death, so we can ignore that guy. Follow my lead. No holy God, the damage. Oh, the damage! 69. Ooh. Yeah, this side of Hawaii, I cannot be challenged. Maybe the beach, though. That one section in Aloha Beach is still a little bit sus. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, oh! Shooting Kiryu like that. Oh. Please, he's an old man going through a lot right now. I won't hold back. Oh, nice! We got a threefer! <laughs> the scream when they're burning! Skill hacking. Oh, getting burned to death. That's a brutal way to go. Follow my lead. I murdered the guy, straight up. Insert coins, thank you so much for the seven months. There's a chicken? If you can call it pork, yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, if that's pork, then I'm Hawaiian. You are by my book, brother. Pass the bag, pass them. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Mm, snack time, dinner time, any time. Got to be musubi. I heard that, buddy. And my time has come, so if you'll excuse me. We mm. can't lose. Oh, huh? man, that is a ticket. There's nothing like it. Mm. And for the main course, Hey, uh, you. Oh, we keep it Die. And for the main course, you have to wait until after this battle. Oh god, no! The creepy waifus! No! I won't do that. Let's see you try. Cool. That's a terrifying chicken. What makes him terrifying? He's just a little chicken. He's just a little guy, you know? That's no good. But a little on the lighter side. How do you like you know the way to my heart? And your fresh poke courtesy of 
Ahi Poke Garden. Oh, give me, give me. Oh. Mm. Uh, all right. Okay. Wait, hold on. I need, I need to know where to go now. Let's go down here. All right. Now, go ahead. Now, hit us with the chomp. Hit like, us with your chomp. Oh, another one. You like one? Not that one. Okay. Um, um, um. <laughs> I tell you, nothing beats the fresh tuna. Little seaweed, little sesame, money in the pot. Oh, yeah. I like a little touch of heat myself. And the rice is sticky like I like it. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Oh. Only thing we're missing Fine. is a nice cold pint to wash Hello. it down with, huh? Anyways, the feast Hello. is on. So while we chow down, I figured we could walk our listeners through the old... Well, the buffet here, so to speak. Oh, can, the uh, buffet? Fill him in on some more classic Hawaiian eats. You know, the real grinds, as Aloha. the kids like to say. Yeah, that's right. You know I be grinding, bro. Right. Bring them straight oh, we be grinding. Right? Well, okay then. If you're asking me, no week in Hawaii is complete without, I don't know, a little bit of loco moco, a little bit of, you know. Oh, loco bread, moco. I need to try that. Try that. Egg, the hamburger steak, bro. Oh, that sounds delicious. You know, you gotta follow that up with a little bit of shave ice. You know mm. what I'm saying? There's a big difference between shave ice and a slushy. I made the mistake of asking somebody about what the difference was between a shave ice no. and a slushy. I almost got you my head bit off. I, Wait. I, he brings up a good point. What is the difference between a slushy and shave? I mean, like, a slushy kind of is. You just have more flavor in it, I guess, but sh is it not the same thing? <laughs> bra, I'm surprised you're still alive, This bra. was a long time ago and it was a big mistake and I would like to apologize to that person right here, Pokemon. <laughs> you get the rainbow kind. I can I keep did. going. Okay, with you drink a slushy. It's just more ball. ground Absolutely. up ice. That stuff is amazing. You know what else is Aloha. good? Those Portuguese donuts, those uh, malasadas. Malasadas, so that. good. Mm -mm -mm. Thank like you. Yours. Oh, I love the ones with the chocolate on the inside. Oh, mm. you know from that one bakery. Ooh. Oh, that's right. Yep, yep. Those love guys that. know how to make them. Oh, you know, and you know what? We gotta go back to the. How place, dare? Right? Yeah, I just offended place. more yeah. people. Katsu, you know, uh, I had a lot of this in Japan hey. too. You know, we do it a little different out here, but it's right. I'm trying. I hear that. Listen, I'm go. I'm gonna go back to another little local uh, local favorite. The Lao Lao. Simple though it may be, once you open up those leaves, you will never want to. Hey, what? What do you? What, don't, hey, come on, man. Leave some hey, for the rest. You're talking about them. You what? You want me to not eat them? You, you <laughs> want you to, to share with me? Ah, uh, nah, nah. Here, we'll take a break for Chitose here. I assume the rent around here is pretty high. Probably. Now you got me curious. I'ma look it up. You ever see a nice home and wonder what it's like to live there? Oh yes, all the time. It's nice to imagine stuff. Living it up in a place to call your own. I guess a guy can dream. So according to this, you'll need to shell out twenty-five hundred bucks a month. Oh. That be somewhere over three hundred thousand yen. Damn, forget that. Yeah, guess you'll have to keep dreaming. Yep, I'm, right. I'll keep dreaming. 2500 a month, Jesus. Fuck, how do people afford anything these days? You don't! No splash! I have three of them, two of them. Oh, you can have two, I'll have one. Just hand all me right, one. Alright, alright, I'm gonna one. get some lomi lomi salmon, a little bit of... Hold on. Even the hotels and cars are big and full of Everything's supersized. Just wait till you try the fast food here. Oh, Order she's tr she's right, she's right. Got an extra large, <laughs> at least by Japanese standards. Yeah, no kidding. If I lived here a few months, I'd go back home and be like, Yo, what'd you do to the food? You use a shrink ray or something? <laughs> <laughs> I bet you would. Too bad we can't shrink the travel time. We're really oh. opening up. Yeah, that flight is not... Oh, I was about to get hit by a car. I still might get hit by a car. I'm just going around, you know. We're just going to learn about Chitose casually. Oh, there's also this I saw. So, um, the finale with Tomizawa. With Tomi. So, we can head down there afterward. We're just kind of going... Oh, Jesus. God. That car almost hit me. All right. Give me my podcast back. Long rice. Oh, don't what? forget the Hello? boy. Oh, yeah. You know, we got the lao lao. We hey. got the boy. I'm a big 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 boy.
throw the teacup of bed, I always say. I would say three Hello, fingers. Uh, it doesn't come in uh, four fingers. Hey. It comes in four fingers. I want four fingers. Hey. I just want a handful. I just want, I want all of it. I just want all of it. You ever tried poi before, Mike? I, uh, Here, I try have. Try some of these. Try some of these. I have. Let me see. All right. Mm. You know? Oh, oh my God. No. Sounds good. You're one of the only people not from Hawaii that likes poi. I can't good. even believe them. Mm. <laughs> it's really, really good. Mm. Oh, my God. Well, <clears throat> you just got a, a lot of points there, Mike. You just got a lot of Hawaii street cred right there. You're not the only big boy that likes poi. <laughs> See what I did there? Oh, my yeah. God. That, I, I got to stop listening after that pun. Uh. <sighs> Nothing like the smell of... Actually, that wasn't even a pun. That was just well, rhyming. Really bad rhyming. Oh, heck yeah. I'm happy just staring at it. Okay. You know how some cafes use those drip machines? They're pretty enchanting to watch. And different cafes have different ones. Coffee watching, huh? There's a hobby for everyone. Maybe I should be more observant next time I grab a cup. <laughs> yeah, Just maybe I should be. The barista or they might spill. All right. Okay, okay. I like my fish and boy, I'm one big boy, bro. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> You're gonna cry. Let's do it. God, these fuckers. <laughs> I'll just like sick him into the ocean. Chose is getting more and more based. Hey, All right, well, that about does it. And good just thing too, because reminder I'm that we can't trust her fully. Oh my god, I cannot step on this. That ever happen to you? All that digestion is supposed to send signals to your brain or something. You get the like the you get. The oh wait, it's down here. And you get the loud loud, and you get the shave ice, and all mixes nah, together. Nah. This makes me really want to try Hawaiian food. My brain and my belly got teamwork. No, what's the Kanaka attack called? Um, call it the iris on the on the mainland. The iris. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, one team, Hello? one dream, my belly, my brain. Uh, you know what? I kind of feel like a talk story uh, segment should be coming on right now. Oh, okay. You know what? What, what, I what the heck? I don't know how to describe it. One moment I was Hello? on the ground. And the next thing I know, I was flying through the air like an acrobat. Huh. Have you ever thought of keep joining going. the search? Don't need to. I already work with Mike the Great White Howley. What more could I want? I right, thank you very much. I would, uh, so, wait, in this, in this scenario, am I the ringmaster or some sort of lion tamer, or am I one of those clowns that jumps out of the car? <laughs> are you on the whole circus? Oh, uh, there we go. Anyway, so where were we? Oh, you were flying. Right, I was zipping around. You trust her fully? I don't. I run from a spatula. Totally out of control. She double crossed us once. Don't think that she won't do it again. You know, dream stuff. Stars, moons, hoops, gems, or I couldn't make heads or tails of Yeah, neither can I. Wait, hold on a second. You kill flies with a spatula? Ah, you know, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Oh, and with a spatula? Okay, all right. That works too. Did you wash the spatula before you use it to cook again? Ah, depends. Or do you have like a dedicated fly spatula? You got one dedicated fly spatula here in the island bro. i like it i like okay. it and then suddenly woke up felt like i just got off a roller coaster so i did what i normally do crawled out of bed for a midnight snack i hear that mm. well i guess midnight snacks well that ends well, my they're friend. nice and that is the end of our segment folks we got more of our Red. show coming up within the hour but first a word from our sponsors or several sponsors yeah. sponsors yeah we still got sponsors brother to help you. We got sponsors, Brada. All right, that's the end. We listen to the next episode. So let's go finish our love life with uh, Tomi. Final talk here. This seems very romantic. Look at this setting, though. Tomi and I were chatting about checking out coffee shops. Is now good? Yeah, now is like the best time. Let's do it. And then we'll do Sujimon after this.
That is one hell of a trek. Take a breather. Is this actually like first person? It, this feels like yeah, we're on a date. The whole island tagging along with you. I miss my taxi. Hey man, karma's a bitch. Oh, and I know it. But it hasn't been all bad. It's like this town kind of seems brand new when I look at it through your eyes. There's a new surprise around every corner. Real? I feel the same way. I don't know left from right out here. But I feel at ease with you and Chicha by my side. We just Friends met her. Kind of sucked, but in the end, we become pals. Funny the way things turn out. That's thanks to you. For anyone else, I doubt we'd be chumming it up over coffee. Not that I should talk. You're one of a kind, each Ichiban. Oh, no kidding. Oh, that was really well, then, cute. Here on out, I can't oh. disappoint. <laughs> kind of tricks you have up your sleeve. Hmm, well, let's see. <sighs> um starting a band now let's open up a shop together what do you say we open up shop together don't you want to open a cafe mm -hmm. i imagine a more quiet vibe but it'd be fun with our rowdy gang around of course and we're in luck i have management experience at, at a senbei shop oh, yeah still, ichiban confections we have the, the experience man man you're Oh, oh, come, come on. With you. Maybe because I can say shit unfiltered. Nothing wrong with a little discretion, no? Not that I've ever used any. Why am I not surprised? Anyway, let's head out. Wow, look at that sunset. This is so romantic. What the hell? It's never hit me like this. Wow, that's gorgeous. Hey, why don't we take a pic? Title it, Our Beautiful Sunset Memorial. Oh my god, even a picture. Such a dumb name. Whatever. Oh, we're on a date. Bar Ocean Boys. <laughs> that came out pretty good. Our next pick should be the Sunny Sunrise Memorial. How many memorials are you planning to make? Several. A photo with Tomi has been added to the Bond Bingo screen. Oh, 100. Oh my god! You don't see, we just jumped from like 33 oh to 38. So we just jumped five levels out of nowhere. Wait, can I go this way? They're implying I can go this way. Um, Suji spot. Uh, PC shop. I need to buy more of these super gifts in case, just in case. What are you looking at? What are you looking at, punk? Oh no, a friend is in danger. I gotta help him out. Can I make a snack? Oh, uh, make. can you make me a snack? I would like a grilled cheese sandwich. If you could send me one, that'd be great. Remember, if you want to bond with the homies, take them on a romantic beach date. I know. I'm such a romantic now. I can't pass up all this weed, you know? You know what I'm saying? That's, uh, that's a lot of nice weed. I can't, I don't want to play Sujimon right now. I just want to do that sub story. That's all I really want. Wait, I gotta get the conversation. No, I don't want it. I don't want the raid. Oh, fuck, that's a bad guy too. God damn it, everywhere I go. Big dog? Big dog about to get fucked up by little dog. I really wish Kiryu would step on me to death for a moment. Hey, Ichiban. Do you use coconut oil? Am I supposed to use coconut oil? I wouldn't know where to start. 
Oh well, that shop over Don't there. Don't harm me, Chet. You stuff. also are the same. Your skin's silky smooth. You should give it a try while you're still here. It's like magic. Not sure an old guy like me needs to worry about silky smooth skin at this point. No way. Taking care of yourself is always important. A well-kept man is attractive. Very true. Okay. Very true. Just having softer skin would be nice. Yep. Better than going soft in the head. <laughs> We're really opening up. Get it? Getting soft in the head? Okay. I'm just saying. I, I think that that was purposeful. It was very on purpose. Drink soon. Oh, I should buy some local honey. Honey? Oh, that sounds really cool, actually. Okay, so we're almost done with all the conversations on this side. Um, I'm gonna head back to Sujimon's hey. sub story. Honey is a pretty popular souvenir from Hawaii, if you didn't know. Oh. Is it really all that different from the stuff you can get in Japan? Yeah, the flavor really varies depending on which flower the bees collect nectar from. For instance, macadamia honey has a slight bitterness to it. <laughs> oh, it's I'm learning. Huh, who would have guessed? I always thought macadamias were only good for dousing in chocolate. Somehow I knew you'd say that. All right. Damn. Hey, are you, are you okay, dude? He has sleep apnea. He needs energy. Uh, well, I do have coffee, but I'm gonna give you the cheapest coffee I have. Uh, eh, deluxe hot coffee. There, you'll be okay, buddy. You'll be okay. Oh god. Wait, this car is gold. Do you have money? Wait, gold car means money, right? Like that's that better be what that means. I need money. Let's go, let's I need go. to pay for college. Something wrong. Ready when you are. Follow my lead. You still got me. Go ahead. Free shot. Is he Oh my god. What an idiot. Oh, Kiryu keeps on getting shot. Poor guy. I won't hold back. Thank you, Ichiban. I love chestnut honey. I've never been a person that's been really big into honey. Oh, can I? Wait, can I? Oh, never mind. I thought I could do it again. All right, so sub story. We're going to fight the discreet four. Here we go. According to Morikasa, this is Jack's home turf. The CEO of Suji. Oh God. Yes. Jack's their newest member. I heard he's some filthy rich day trader who brought his way up the Suji ladder. He uses all that money to poach rare and powerful Sujimon from around the world, and that's what hit, got him in, in with the four. We're just screwed then. I'm not going to go up against some super buff Sujimon from Scandinavia or wherever. Nonsense. If Jack paid for his Sujimon, then there's no way he develops bonds of friendship with them. Not like our ragtag crew, right, Sensei? Huh? Bonds? Ah, uh, yeah, that's right. Friendship is what matters in Sujimon battling, not... Strength and ability. Uh huh. So come on, let's show this guy you can't pay to win with some OP Sujimon. Real Sujimon battle for the love we have for our trainer. So remember, if we lose, it's all Kasuga-san's fault for not getting us to love him enough. <laughs> okay. Let's go! We'll take out the discreet four, starting with Jack, and then go all the way to Suji Land. I really hope he's joking about Suji Land. Okay, uh, I guess we'll head inside when we're ready. I'm, I'm, I think I'm ready. Yeah, let's save and uh, let's go fight the discreet four, shall we?
kind of figured Jack's gym would look more like a gym. Right. Well, well, what do we have here? His... <laughs> okay. Are you Jack? Right. Oh, yes, but do address me by my full title. Jack CEO and member of the Discreet Four, obviously. Phew, I recognize you. You were with Professor Morikasa uh -huh. earlier. Guilty as charged. Name's Yasuo Sodachi, and I'm here to take you down, Jackie boy. Oh, no, not you. The other one. Okay. Him. I'm Ichiban Kasuga. Morikasa asked me to take down King and become a Sujimon master. I kind of forget why, but whatever. <laughs> to do that, I guess I've got to get through the discreet four, right? So, uh, I challenge you. Mm. That cool? Oh, it's very cool. Only, sadly, I'm quite the busy bee, so I haven't got time to take on just anyone. Oh, I gotta prove my worth, okay. Mm -hmm. Alright. It's my job to make Mr. Jack's life easier. Sending you packing now is just another day's work. Alright, I think I gotta update my party. I've gotten a lot more Sujimon, and I haven't updated my people. That guy has really good agility, but at the same time, I have this extermination coon. <laughs> extermination coon. Um, who else did I just get recently? Oh, this guy. Coconut, so I have coconut chop. Destructo beam. Heal allies with soothing herbs. These are all fire types, though. I probably shouldn't only have fire types on my front line, right? That's probably not a good idea. Is that a robot? It is. Isn't it so cute, too? It's adorable. Okay, I really... Um... Hmm. This is a very serious game, by the way. You should be taking it seriously. Okay. We can take them. Let's give it everything we got. Everyone ready? Time for a Sujimon battle. <laughs> I love the robot. Remember, this is my first time there. using the robot in combat since I got him. <laughs> Your team looks pretty good. Here comes Punch City. You think you can hurt me? Oh, honey. Nicely done. Extra knuckles, you're gonna have to do better than that. Fight! Let's do this. Okay, let's see if we can do it. Right Got it. Hell yeah. ah! Just like we oh, almost, almost. So close. You're finished. Want to check out your streams? Welcome to the stream. Appreciate you stopping by. Also, Liam, welcome as well. I keep finding new reasons to really want to play this game. If you've never played a Yakuza game, you need to play the Yakuza series. All the games are as stupid as this one, and they're fantastic. Oh, I love getting gotcha tickets. I think I've only used it. I've only used two tickets before. Shameful display. This is why you'll always be middle management. It falls to the corporate overlords to clean up the messes of the dregs. Let me show you how an executive battles. Okay. Same party formation? I kind of want to 
switch. Oh wait, um, wait, swap positions, there we go. I want the robot in the middle now. <laughs> Should you start with like a dragon? Um, you can. It depends on how much time you have. Uh, my recommendation is always starting with Yakuza 0 and literally playing the series in order. Like 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. <laughs> but if you don't have time for that, I would recommend playing maybe Yakuza 0 and 1. You can kind of watch, like if you're, if you don't have the time, you can watch like two through, maybe three through six if you want, instead of playing it, just to like get the plot. Uh, you can start with seven, it's totally fine. There's just a lot less, I guess, impact, because there is a lot from the older games in it. But Yakuza 0 is really a fantastic starting point. I love this robot so much. How much does it take? So we have one I MP. I don't think I'll be able to use my robot's uh, special. Nicely done. Oh, damn it. Time to die. <laughs> you never checked out my Twitch? Oh, well, I appreciate you coming here. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, Straw Hat. Yeah, Zero is the best, best, best place to start for sure. Alright, let's see if we can do this. Ah, damn it. So it works. Whoa! I'm so glad we won! Love my Persona video, Let's thank you! Speaking of, my Persona 5 Tactica video just went live like 14 minutes ago. <laughs> I don't understand! How can you have beaten me? Because you're a pussy, that's why. That's both of Jack's underlings, now I can challenge the man himself. Here we go. The Elite Four. This is a nice place. What the hell? I'm not sure how I feel about all the gold. It's a little bit weird. But yeah, this is this is an oh what? Oh nice, I got some Suji munch. Wait, can I um I haven't done like any evolutions yet. Awakenings. Yeah, I haven't done any of that stuff yet. Strengthen. Nah, we're fine. Look at these dudes over here. <laughs> they look like idiots. And I love it. Hey. <clears throat> well, Jack, I beat your stooges. Gonna accept my challenge now? I'm a man of my word. My three ex-wives notwithstanding. Okay. <sighs> Still, I'm experiencing this strange sensation of seeing you defeat my men. It's almost like shame. Oh, I really went the wrong way there. There we go. Sir, it was our worthless Sujimon's fault! Stop your whip burning before I use you and your Sujimon to fuel my next private spacecraft. Oh, shit. <laughs> Let's end this quickly. You must know I've invested a considerable amount of money into my Sujimon collection. You and your, uh, allies, as it were? You can't truly expect to stand up to me, can't, can you? Don't you see what a mistake you're making? Hell no, I don't! You know, I'd can't, I could take or, or leave a lot of this Sujimon Master stuff, but humbling a rich asshole? I'm always down for that. People like you see the whole world as assets in your portfolio. You'll never understand the camaraderie of a team working together. How did you know I have some such a thinly veiled fetish for breaking the will of uppity pores? That's why the Suji League is the ultimate rich man sport. The endless naive urchins to humiliate. You don't want to know what I do as I rewatch the battle footage each Excuse night. Me? Um <laughs> uh, okay. 
Screw this hoity-toity jerk. <laughs> hoity-toity. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he definitely needs to, like, do other things in life. All right. We get a hotel badge as a reward. Japanese master ticket. Oh, yes. All right, we can do this, guys. We can do this. I'm wondering if I should put a healer on the front line. I'm going to try it, see what happens. Just in case. I could have lived so long without knowing that. I mean, yeah, I could have too. Some things you just gotta, you know, read and listen to. We just have to accept that fact. Ooh. Okay. Attention is thick. Good thing Sujimon are paid by the hour. Oh god, we have a commentator for this battle. Any last words? I can't lose my healer. I guess I do have a backup healer though. I could swap. So we don't lose our healer. They're really trying to take him out. Oh, he's almost dead. Look at the concentration on these freaks' faces. Considering a pinch hitter, maybe. I don't know if that's gonna do anything, but I'm just gonna try. Is that one dead? Someone check if they're dead. Someone check if they're dead. Yes, they are fucking dead. Okay. Attention is that it? Okay. Paid by the hour. I love this Four old man. That's it. Got him. <laughs> I can't be good, right? Back to the drawing board. He's still trying to go after the healer. Wow. What a bitch. Folks, I'm getting the Sujimon Super Oh, baby! The trainer's reconsidering the lineup for their life choices. Oh, baby! I'm considering their life choices. <laughs> Any last words? Suji goes to sleep or goes to hell, one or the other. <laughs> Look at the concentration on these freaks' faces! <laughs> this will put you down. <laughs> oh, oh, my goodness! Can you feel that energy? Suji's got a special Time incoming! Wow. That guy's getting fucking owned. I want to use Destructo Beam really bad. We almost have 3 MP. I'm probably not going to be able to use it. Any last words? <laughs> Suji goes to sleep! Or goes to hell, one or the other. Uh, we do have 3 MP now. Holy shit! Considering a pinch hitter, maybe. <laughs> Holy shit! They switched places! Folks! I'm getting the Wait, I don't have three MP? Oh. Oh, I'm like really close. Okay. Back to the drawing board, huh? Time to die. Yeah. Destructo beam. Let's do this. I got it. No! I, can't believe what I missed. 
Considering a pinch hitter, yes, maybe. So shut you up. Is that one dead? Someone check if they're dead. My goodness! That's the match! It's over! It's over! We did it! You guys are the best! Let's wrap up this victory! I... This game. <laughs> Amazing! Kasuka's team never fails to impress! His secret? Heavy petting! Yeah, chew on that one, folks! Sweet! <laughs> I shouldn't have cut off the commentator! No! <laughs> That's our win! We did it, Kasuga-san! Kiss my ass, money bags, with your fancy toupee and your bank account! Damn it. This is America. To the poor, don't overthrow the rich. You're supposed to worship me! <laughs> oh, jeez. This is too real, man. Too real. Consider this a lesson in economics, fat cat. <laughs> Back in the day, I had my own dojo. Then the property value went up, so I sold it. Then I burnt through all the cash, except for some, which I donated to a weird cult. And here I am! So as you see, I may be poor now, but at one point I was a little less poor. Mm. <laughs> it, all, it, all goes to, it all goes to show. Kasuga, uh, what was I trying to say? How the hell should I know? You know, we rich always laugh about you poor idiots on the golf course in our secret underground death casinos, but I never knew just how stupid you really were. Stop whining, Jack. Mm. King? And ace and queen? Even Joker? Oh. Oh, now I know why his name is Jack. Oh. Jack, queen, king, ace, joker. Oh, okay. We got You get it now. We heard Morikasa's new favorite issue to challenge. Obviously, we came to cheer you on. Lo and behold, it seems you've been defeated. You were never worthy of the discreet four. Soon the rabble will think of us as all think us all as weak and toddy as you. Who are these guys? The rest of the discreet four, Joker, Queen, and Ace, they're all incredibly strong. I'm not defeated! I underestimated him, that's all! King, you believe me, don't you? It's too I'm too important to the four to fail. You'll bail me you'll bail me out, right? You have to. I'm afraid the committee's already rendered its decision. You're of no further use to them. You can't do this. I'm one of you. I'm an elite. I'm sorry, Jack. The committee must never be questioned. <sighs> Damn it all. You, trainer, what's your name? I'll remember that. Dude, the boa, though. He really has a boa? <laughs> I can't even remember the last time I saw somebody wearing a boa. It's so, like, 80s? <laughs> so you are this Kasuga fellow whose name we've heard about we've heard oft whispered of late. You'll find our gem along the beach. We shall await your, wait your arrival. Unlike this testosterone dampened sanctum of avarice, ours is a lovely chamber, an ode to the female form in all of its glory. Do not keep us waiting over long. <laughs> oh my god. I'll catch the next cab. <laughs> Look at us, we're winners! For once in your and my pathetic lives. We're winners. <laughs> Taking down Jack in such a short amount of time is no joke! We've got something special going! <laughs> well, thanks guys. Couldn't have done it without you. Yeah, yeah, just keep it in mind. Queen strength is supposedly magnitudes higher than Jack's. If we don't put in the work, we're gonna lose. Don't be such a downer, Karaki. Positive state of mind, okay? Even if we lose, we just crawl back up and try again, right, Sensei? Oh, my queen. Bet your butt I'd crawl my way to her. All the better for her to step on me. Sensei, are you even listening? Oh, yeah, <laughs> that's right. Our bonds of friendship are what's important. We're doomed. Anyway, Queen may have given us the invite, but the Suji League rules mandate we reach a certain rank before we challenge her. Okay. 
Your Sujimon max level is 20. From now on, you'll also have better odds of triggering a bonus raid. The quality of items you receive from spots will improve. The Sujimon Stadium has opened its doors to you. Okay. Whoa. You can now challenge the Sujimon Stadium. Oh. From the Sujigami PC shop in the Anaconda Shopping Center featuring three different leagues. Challenge, Survival, and Grand League. Oh, wow. Okay. Visit the stadium whenever you'd like to test your Sujimon skills and cash in points. Holy crap. Sometimes I forget that Sodachi is a Sujimon himself. Oh, well. Sounds like we've got our work cut out for us with this queen. We can take her. All right. I will get to max level 20 by tomorrow's stream. I'll, I'll do it off stream. I've unlocked the Suji Mancer job. However, you will need to progress the story before you can use it. What? Suji Mancer is an exclusive job for Kasuga, which allows him to summon his Sujimon into actual con- What? Use the equipment menu to set your preferred Sujimon, and you can use one Sujimon of each type. And remember, the stronger your Sujimon, the stronger your skill. That's awesome! What the fuck? Yo, that is sick. I can't use the class yet because I have to do story though, which does suck. But holy shit, that's cool. This game is awesome! <laughs> okay. Yeah, Like a Dragon 7, the last game also had different classes as well. It's really cool. It's only exclusive Don't to worry. 7 and 8, so you have to understand if you're new to Yakuza, uh, Yakuza 7 and 8 are very unique. Uh, the battle style changed it completely to turn-based, whereas Yakuza 0 through 6 are action. They're brawler action type games. So the the it's a very, very big jump in the series to the current combat, how it is now. Oh, this is such a cute outfit! It's perfect for hula dancing! You know how to hula? On an entry level, yeah. See, dancing's one of my passions. I've done ballet, <laughs> classical Japanese. Aloha. Classical. Wait, why did she? St oh, I guess she stopped talking because I I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Thank you. All right, keep going. Oh, fuck me. I'm so sorry. Oh, this is such a cute outfit. It's perfect for hula dancing. You know how to hula? On an entry level, yeah. See. Dancing's one of my passions. Hey I've done ballet, classical Japanese dance, and even hip hop. You dance at all, Ichiban? Uh, the most I can do is a few old festival or folk dances. <laughs> huh. Don't think I've tried those. You should teach me sometime. Uh, sure, but what are you not be all that cool to watch, you know? <laughs> That's okay. I'll just have fun seeing you demonstrate. I would enjoy that really too. Opening up. I would very much enjoy that. All right. Um, I guess we're going to do a little bit of plot. I could get more conversations on this side of the map with Chitose, but I think it's just we'll come across them naturally later. I don't need to go super out of my way right now. So with a very clean looking map. Uh, oh. We're going to go get that real quick. And then we're going to go to revolve. We're actually going to do the plot for a little bit. It depends, because if it opens up a lot of uh, sub-stories, then we're going to do the sub-stories. I could take on anything. <clears throat> yeah, a little, a little bit of plot, like a little, little bit. We'll see if Chitose actually gets some karaoke. That'd be interesting. Tomi didn't get any karaoke, though, so maybe not. I was surprised. I thought maybe he was important enough to get one, but he's not important enough. Tommy's not important. Oh, look at 
look at all the goodies here. Just like the old-timey sweet shops back home. You're into Japanese sweets? Yeah, they're all so bright and colorful. Although, I've never actually gone and bought any myself. Really? Never? Nope. Only read about them in books. I'd love to actually try them sometime. Then I gotta take you to a real old-fashioned mom-and-pop shop back in Japan. Some even give out bonus prizes. <laughs> you can pick up the 300 yen worth of snacks. My treat. Oh, that's so sweet. Wow. <laughs> no pun intended. Thank you. Oh, you intended right. the pun. Don't lie to me. Don't fucking lie to me! I never found assorted cigarettes. God damn it. I've been shopping in like every place Great, too. Dude. That sucks, dude. Oh yeah, I did go down here before. Hey lady, what's up? You look very suspicious. <gasps> Hong Kong boy! Oh, she's a Hong Kong! It's only a hundred dollars, a honko for a hundo. She's cheaper than the other guy we found. Yo, I'm getting honked. Close your eyes. Was it everything you dreamed of? Everyone deserves a honk honk now and then. Now that I got honked, I feel like I can do the plot now. Looking at everything we know about Akane-san, it took an entire organization to gather this. But all it really amounts to is a birth date and an address. <sighs> that doesn't sound right. Kiryu-san, I thought that agency was all 007, like with spies and stuff. Shouldn't they be able to write the entire books on someone? Yeah, what gives? Could be she's harder to track as a member of the general public. Whereas if she kept a higher profile, uh, there'd be no shortage of news coming in. Ah, good point. Chitose, it can be the tiniest detail. But if you know anything that's not on here, we need to know too. Actually, one thing does come to mind. Oh yeah? What is it? None of this says anything about her career. Her career? Yeah. Kane-san's the director of an orphanage. She's been there, like, forever. Oh! The no orphanage kidding. on the other side of the map? Well, Captain Sawashiro never mentioned anything like that. Maybe he didn't know either. I haven't been to the place in person, but I do know where it is, if you're interested. You bet I'm interested. That orphanage might have the clues we need. Agreed. Let's head over there. Mm. It's getting late, so let's try the orphanage tomorrow. Still, it's a bit early to hit the hay. Could wander around a little. True. Tommy's drinking all by himself. Oh. We haven't really had time to chat since we teamed up. Maybe I should go and talk to him. Oh, Tommy's drinking by himself. Yo, Tommy, mind if I join you? I was just hoping for a drinking partner. Ha, yeah, then I'm your man. Let's do this. Whoa, some days it really hits the spot. You much of a drinker, usually? Kinda. Except when I came to Hawaii. I got so wasted, my clothes were stolen. Hard to claim I can hold my liquor after that. <laughs> it was oh, yeah. Chitose's fault, by Hi. the way. What about you? I've cut back lately. A while ago, I was going way too hard. Yeah, trying to forget. Oh, forget about Marie, you mean? Yeah, more or less. Tommy's old flame, Marie, when he was in prison, the Barracudas framed him. She vanished. Yeah, but, you know, hey, time heals all wounds is what they always say. 
Even being stripped bare-ass in public. You know, you'll laugh about it in a few years. <laughs> I bet Marie's doing well. I'm sure Marie's out there somewhere, by the way. Living happily. Huh. Yeah, thanks. I'd like to think so, too. Oh, sorry, I just had a thought. Alan, could we adjust the command to say beginning of April? Because, like, two months is going to be subjective, like, every day that passes. So, like, if we have that command in one month, it's going to say two months. It it'd probably better if we say, like, beginning of April. The Barracudas ruin way more lives than just mine and Marie's, you know? I mean, that... Frame job scam was old hat by the time they got me. It's just hard to imagine anyone else took it at their happiest moment, you know, like I did. Girl, I loved just having my kid. I would have given anything for one more day with her. Oh. Sorry, I shouldn't have brought it up. Eh, don't be an idiot. I'm always thinking about it anyway. And so the night that Marie and I first met. Oh, you want to talk about this? Do you mind? It's been a long time since I told this story. Let me get through it. Oh, well, I, I'm happy to listen, I guess, if, if you're okay. Yeah. Oh, I can't believe it was over a decade ago. Ugh. Means I've been cabbing that long, too. That's so long. Back then, I'd spend my nights at clubs, picking up girls, which, of course, went nowhere, usually. Usually? <laughs> that, that word's doing some heavy lifting. <laughs> Do you want to hear my story or not? Okay, okay, sorry. One night, I hit on this girl with a boyfriend. I wouldn't normally do that, but I was dead drunk. And the boyfriend, like, he's this massive pro wrestler looking lifter. And he dragged me to an alley and he kicked the shit out of me so bad, I thought I might actually die. That's the worst pickup story ever. Does Marie really what the heck? Stop interrupting. I'll get there. So I'm lying in the alley, hurling out my guts. And then this woman finds me and cleans me up. Marie happened to be there that night with one of her co-workers. We'd never seen one another before. But there she was, caring for a total stranger, staining in her nice clothes with my blood. Wow, well, that's something special. Probably the worst night of my life. Before she made it the best. Oh. The hell, I made a move on her. I mean, how could I let someone like that slip away? Oh. Really? You no, know, it's funny. You know, I say it's the best night of my life, but down the road, it's what ends up ruining hers. Wow, Tommy. When we found out she was pregnant, she quit her job. Six months later. I was in prison. Oh my god, what a timeline of events. like me couldn't let her go. She could have had so much better. Uh, I bet, I bet Marie doesn't think so. Marie wouldn't see it that way, I'm sure. I appreciate you saying so, but there's no way to find out. Hey, Tommy, do you ever think about trying to locate her? You said she would visit you, right? In the beginning, at least? Of course I tried looking for her. First thing I did. No luck. When I got back to our home, everything of hers was gone. Not a trace left behind. Don't follow me. Doesn't get much clearer. <sighs> I left this amazing woman to suffer all on her own. She'd lost a child. Whatever the circumstances might have been. You can't go on with someone after that. <sighs> you know what? I'm a pretty bad judge of character. Huh? Why, why, why you say that? <laughs> the first time we met, you pulled a gun on me, remember? Yeah, yeah. We never forget. If you asked me then, I'd have said you were nothing more than a petty crook. But now, listening to you, I think everybody's carrying something you can't see right away. Everybody out there. That's true. <laughs> I, I'd almost forgotten about sticking you up. Did I ever apologize to you for that? It doesn't matter anymore. Uh, no. Some things do matter. Huh? I am sorry for the way we met, Ichiban. Aww. Well, you're forgiven. If you buy the next round. Let bygones be. I just don't rob anybody else either. Huh. 
I'll do my best. Oh, that was so cute. Oh, drink links with these heart to hearts. Your allies can unlock powerful abilities, tag team skills combos, initiate drink links at hangouts like Revolve and check their progress. Tag team cross slugger. I want to, I want to have a drink with Kiryu. I want to have several drinks with Kiryu. Nice to mellow out with a drink once hey. in a while. Hey, what are you doing tonight? It's getting late and you look pretty drunk, so maybe sleep it off upstairs, yeah? You don't mind? Not at all. Like I said, you're free to make yourself Thanks. at home. But Kiryu's Hotel. Wait, I would much rather stay at Kiryu's Hotel. They have karaoke here. One song couldn't hurt. We can go to the orphanage tomorrow. I don't know why my tongue gets so loose when we drink together. Oh well, guess it's not such a bad thing. Nah, not a bad Welcome. thing. Thanks. Alright, let's see if Chitose has a um song. I doubt it though. Guess it's my turn. Wait. Chito oh, she does have a song! Get out! Time to see Chitose's song. This one's for you guys. Honolulu New song! <laughs> Groovy. Wait, did I just get I love you? Oh. That was my first time hearing and playing that song. How did I per get a perfect? Are you fucking kidding me? play Baka Mithai, and I hate, I now hate playing like Baka Mithai, by the way, on stream, because uh, it gets copyrights. It's the one song that gets copyright striked, so it, it does suck to play it. Wait, Baka Daro? Wait. This is a new one. But yeah, no, it gets uh, it gets copyright striked. It really sucks. So every time I play Bakamitai now, I have to mute the VOD. This is a new song. I didn't know there was another. It's it kind of just snuck in there. Now, lend me your ears. 
You're killing it! <laughs> Playing the fool, scorned by love. Even then, you open Cheer your yourself! heart to me. Yeah! Though I tried to speak, they just wouldn't leave. Three small words. I love you. You're killing it! to your memory yeah! Oh, just one more won't ever be enough I will stay here just to be near knowing where How's my soul friends? Playing the fool Too dumb to tell Too dumb to know Too stupid to see A wounded heart It's worse than Bakamitai, what the fuck? I don't- I don't want to cry. I'm just gonna move on. Well, my eyes are watering up, but... Uh, moving on! Moving on! Y'all didn't see anything that just happened, right? I didn't. <sighs> Alright, come with me. Wait, did no sub stories actually pop up? Holy shit. Really? Time to put our feet up. Ichiban. You got a minute? Uh, I wanted to ask something. Me? Sure. I'm always down. I, and not to get too heavy, but it's uh, about Marie again. Yeah, you remember? You know, a after I went to prison, she pretty much vanished from the earth. Figured she never wanted me to look for her. And, and I'm fine with that. If she's happy somewhere. So I, uh, I got in touch with some old friends we had. Ones I haven't seen since. I asked if any of them had heard from her. I know how she's doing. Holy shit, did you find anything out? Is she okay? Long story short, yeah, probably. I don't know 100% yet. Right, you have to see for yourself, don't you? Y yeah, only when I think about that, it won't exactly be easy seeing her again. Yeah, in so many words? Yeah. Tell me. Marie's friend told me that while I was locked up, she nosedived bad. She'd already quit her job for the baby, 
but then she lost touch with everyone else in her life. Oh my god. She might have left Hawaii entirely at that point, according to them. Really? Well, that could be why you didn't find anything when you first looked. Yeah, but recently someone saw her on a beach here in the city. She's back in the old neighborhood. Uh, apparently, she looks all right from a distance. Well, what are you going to do? Tell me. Marie uh, may be back on her feet, but for all I know, she only got there by burying the past. In that case, she could very well want me to stay forgotten. But, no way. She wouldn't think that. And there's... You know, what have I done besides lick your my boots since I got out again? If Aww. I saw Marie today, what would she think of me? Meanwhile, she could be with a new guy. Hell, she could have a new family by now. Ah, <sighs> Tommy. I'm sorry, you didn't sign up for this today. I just... I didn't sign up for a lot of shit, but it just keeps Your happening in this game, so whatever. You would really never want to think about you again? Yeah. I mean, why would she? Look, forget it. I shouldn't have brought this shit up. Just, uh... Tell me one thing, honestly. What would you do in my place? You're me. Would you really go look her up? Yeah. It's scary, but I would do it. Me. There's no other choice, is there? She's back. You have to go find her again. No, I do have a choice here. And there's a wrong option. If Marie's happiness depends on never seeing my face again, I owe it to her to stay gone. But the thing is... Hmm? Nothing will ever be certain until you see it with your own eyes. Understand? You're worrying, well, what if she doesn't want to see you? Well, what if she's in trouble? And needs help. I, I... I don't know. If you really can't do it yourself, I can go check up on her for you. Promise, don't let this opportunity pass you by. It'll keep haunting you forever if you do. Ichiban, man... Uh... Sorry if I was out of line there. <laughs> out of line? No! I, I needed you more than I realized. Thank you. You really helped me. <laughs> cool. You're right. All I know is that Marie or someone who looks like her is in town. Unless I see for myself, everything else is All right, my mind time to see wild. what's going on. <laughs> I hope she's doing well. So do I. We're going to try to <laughs> give Tommy the happy ending. She's got no room in her life for me. Yeah, you know, cuz this be this game sure is probably going to have a sad ending, so somebody's oh, yeah. got to have a happy one, right? <sighs> You're a hell of a guy, Tommy. Is it me or do you sound sad now? Well, this might undermine my advice, but the truth is, I'm in the lurch, too. I proposed to this girl a while back, and she still hasn't given me an answer. Oh, yeah. Whoa, whoa, you're down worse than I am, and I've been listening to you? <laughs> <laughs> I was afraid you'd say that. <laughs> Shit. You need advice from me? Uh, let me think. <laughs> Tell me, find Marie first, and... Then we'll get to my problems. <laughs> All right, but man, talk about ending on a sour note. Yeah, that's why you end chats like this with drinks, not words. Well said. Mm. Oh boy. Can I do another link with him? Jesus Christ, we're getting so much Tommy action right now. Yeah, we'll never forget proposing after the first date. It's such a good idea, don't you know? <laughs> Are there any games you play off stream? I usually do put them on my games list right now. I'm playing Baldur's Gate 3 off stream. Um, and I try to play other games in my spare time, my little spare time that I have. So yeah, they come around. Um, I'm going to go get grapes real quick for this next talk with Tomy. We're just... Tommy time. <laughs>
Let's do this. Hey, Tomi, what up? Ichiban's been on three dates with Tomi and hasn't proposed. <laughs> you look kind of upset. That was pretty do good. I? I, I guess that's no big surprise. Hey, do you feel like talking? I'm down to listen. You could probably imagine what happened. I ended up seeing her. Okay. So okay, okay, how did it go? It actually happened by accident, kind of. She was just at that same beach. Like, I'd never seen her before. And the rumors were true. She came back to Hawaii only recently. I, mean, I didn't get close, but it was her. Without a doubt. Oh, he didn't actually what? say you anything? Didn't talk to her? Couldn't. Marie was there, and her boyfriend was right beside her. Damn. How do you know that? How do you know it was a boyfriend? Uh, how did she look? Don't assume yeah, it's a boyfriend. From what I can tell, she looks great, and they seem to be. What if it's very, just like a guy close. friend? They were making that beach of paradise. Oh laughing, fuck! Kissing, staring at each other. Maybe she was practicing kissing so with a friend of hers. Words, she looked happy, right? <laughs> Well, I mean, when we were together, she she seemed happier in other ways, you know. If all you did was see her from afar, you don't know if she's really. Do people do that really actually? Happy. Oh my God! Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I've only personally had this instance once a friend of mine back in high school actually did i don't know if it's actually that maybe it is a little bit weird i don't know but yeah so like i had a friend in high school who had a guy friend that they were not dating but she wanted to practice kissing and they both agreed to doing that to get better at it. And that was like, I remember whenever she told me that she was doing that with him, I was like, huh, you know, that thought literally never crossed my mind, but that just seems weird because like, you're not, okay. I don't know, but I guess, I guess it could be a thing. They were, they never actually dated. It worked, I think, so I can't judge, right? I can't judge, it worked. I just, I, I, you know what, to this day, I still don't know what to think of that. <laughs> it was, it was just so bizarre. Right? Right? Sure. Too soon to draw any conclusions. I knew it. Yeah. Ichiban, I knew you'd have some new advice to fix that. It was consensual. They so both practiced. They dated other people least. afterwards, so it was a success. I can't words. judge. Yeah, but if she and her boyfriend are doing as great as they seem, I'm, I'd really be in the shit. If they catch me following them a few meters behind, Marie will think I've gone totally crazy. Mm, you're not wrong. Okay, time for me to step up and do my part. Your part? I'll stroll by the two of them, casual, and I'll feel out the Oh, vibes. we're gonna feel out the vibes. Okay, hey, I like you this. you think you could pull that off? Well, if I just clock him for a few minutes, how hard could it be? Um, yeah, sorry, but you couldn't even play it cool enough to get your proposal answered. Uh, okay, well, back to Marie then. What kind of guy was her boyfriend anyway? Uh, probably in his 40s, clean cut type. Looks like he's got money. All right, all right. What else? Yeah, average build, a little on the thin side. No more brains than brawn. He looked nice. Um, how did Marie act with him? She had acted real goddamn happy. Right. That's it. You could keep going, don't stop. There's gotta be some way this isn't what it seems like. <laughs> I never said we're stopping, Tommy. Okay, um, uh, first of all, we have to be absolutely sure. Huh? Look, sometimes it's really hard to gauge how a girl's feeling. Yeah. If I were you, I'd want conclusive proof. Her happiness is more than skin deep. Yep, yep. Good Any point, good point. look happy. It's your responsibility to find out if her face is telling the truth. 
Ichiban. That's right. You're right. What do you think I should do? Talk to her. You and Marie could just talk to each other. For all you know, she might have come back to Hawaii hoping to find you. No way. Even I can't get behind that much wishful thinking, man. Besides, I just know I'd say something stupid, make things worse for her. It's not time yet. I'll talk to her. I will, when I'm ready. Okay, yeah, sure. Just keep drinking Thanks and then you'll be ready. <laughs> Honestly, I couldn't get through this without you. Hey, I'm here for you. Listening doesn't cost a thing. <laughs> We're friends after all. I still got no idea how to proceed, but Marie wise. But no matter what, I know it can't end like this. And I know something else. I got a good, trustworthy friend who has my back. Aww. Well, it's about we drink to that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Cute. You really are an easy guy to talk to, bud. Shush. That's it, then. Make it a combo. Okay. I like that. <clears throat> this is turning into a bromance? It is. Kiryu is just by himself. I have a beer gift set. I have flowers. Here, here, um, Plumeria. Here. Thanks. I got him a present. I'm getting tired. We all need a friend like Ichiban, don't we? Indeed. We really do. All right. So the plot's over here. At the orphanage. We don't have $3,000 yet to get this uh, sub-story moving. I'm very close, though. I have 2400 So like 600 more bucks, and, and we got it. I could get more Chitose conversations in the meantime. Let's Let's start there. So let's go... Is there... There's no way to tell what floor this is on, but I think it's on the first floor. <clears throat> Dude, we are... We are the best of bros right now. Oh, are you kidding me? It's on the second floor? I wish there was a way to tell better. Hello! Hello! I have 50 friends? Oh my god. That is way too many fucking friends. I have too many friends, that's just it. And random rain. Alright, Chitose. Wait, this girl, are you okay? Good around here. Guess I'll come back tomorrow? Oh god, that's how all your money goes away, girl. <laughs> Why is he doing the FF7 thing? Oh, I didn't realize that this MP3 player was already out in store. This one's got great specs, too. While I'm at it, might as well snatch up a new amp. Seems like you're really into this stuff. Whatever it is. Well, normally, your average smartphone's more than enough to play music. But once you start hunting for that hi-fi sound, it becomes a rabbit hole. No end in sight. Oh, that sounds deep. Yeah, it's bottomless. But it does make a whole world of difference. Time to dive in, Ichiban? No! <laughs> We're really opening up. Alright. We can go to this one. Since it's right here. This place is so big. What are you staring at? Shh. 
She speaks audio nerd language. She does. Oh, my phone's almost dead. Need to find an outlet somewhere. I wonder if they'll ever invent a phone that doesn't need to be recharged. No. Oh boy, do I have the perfect gadget for you. Allow me to introduce the paper cup phone. Are you serious right now? I, no, I, I wasn't. <clears throat> My bad. What's with the side? <laughs> What's with no, the side? I'm just messing with you. I've never tried one of those. Is it fun? No lie, it kind of is. If you talk loud, you can actually see the string <laughs> vibrate. <laughs> Whoa, so it's even got vibration settings? All right, let's try it. Hey, if you're down for it. Okay. Time to it has vibration settings. All right. Good to know. Chitose is automatically interested. Anyway. Fine. <clears throat> What's with the side Hearing the radio in a foreign country really hits different, huh? It kind of does, I guess. Never really thought of that. Uh, on my way Same here. goes for reading the local newspaper. True. Doing the local <clears throat> thing can make you feel like you're a long way from home. Of course, it is fun to browse around and let yourself get lost. <laughs> totally. See? You get me. Not to mention getting into fights. Local punks always hit different, too. <laughs> Uh, not sure I can relate, but okay. <laughs> We're really Local opening punks. up. Like We're getting to know Chitose well. pretty well, and it's concerning. I'm I'm liking her more and more, which is not not what I want to be. Uh, yeah, no, I, I I don't want I don't I don't want that. No, I don't want to like her. I don't, I don't, I don't want to like her. Oh, 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 somebody beat up. Let's go. I'm going to crush you. Show me what you got. Oh, that, that guy, they are, they are drinking. Okay. A drunk about and a bacchanal, a bacchanal, bacchan, bacchan alpha. Ooh, all the extra damage we're getting though. Feels good. Binge drinking this dude. I wanna watch you die. Ooh, okay. I'll follow your lead. Combo attack. Whoa! That was kinda hard! Combo with Kiryu. Oh, that is so attractive. Yes. Follow my lady. <laughs> Looks like he overdid it. Oh. That's nasty, bro. Why did it zoom in on Chitose there for a sec? Come on, Me too. Whoa! Chitose, that was so hot. Running more every day. Doing better than I thought. I'm even stronger. Okay. Oh shit, we can. Okay. 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 I want him. I want him. Give me a break. I'm gonna go for the super Suji gift. There you go. Oh Token no. Of friendship. How about it? It's not all the way up yet. Okay. Sure. Okay, good. I can't get any better than that. Drunken outburst, blow all of the alcohol stored in the body. Oh, Jesus Christ. 
He's a tank. Let's go. We're in full swing. They were guarding something? I don't get it. I thought those guys were supposed to be like unlocking areas. For some reason, I always thought these islands had cactuses. These islands have cactuses? Ichiban, where the fuck did you hear that? What? Guess not, huh? Actually, I just saw a big one not far from here. By the way, did you know that cactuses have an IQ of three? What? IQ measures your brain power, right? Does that mean cactuses can think? Well, it's not like researchers can test them, so it's not exactly so. Wait, hold on. Feeding this dog is way more important. And now I just canceled it. I had to feed the dog. Oh, now I gotta feed a chicken. It's 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 really important. Hello. I had to sacrifice. Damn you. I cut the conversation. I'm so sorry. Follow my lead. Oh, nice. Cool. Oh, come on. Together, right? What? <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I'm up. Hmm. Suj uh, instead of creatures or animals, you fight with random dudes. Yeah, don't you just love that? Sujimon is the best thing to ever exist. Aw, oh, now I gotta save this girl. I keep getting distracted. I need to fucking talk to Chitose. We need to get we need to get to know her. Ready as I'll ever be. It's time. He didn't die from that? Damn shame. I won't hold back. Mm. I'll take you off. Poor Tony. Okay, I still gotta see his tag team, though. <laughs> let's go, let's go. It feels like they're holding back on like Kiryu conversations, and I'm not sure why. Everything is very Tomi and Chitose like uh, focused, and I'm like, I just really want to have conversations with Kiryu. <laughs> Please. For some reason, I always thought these islands had cactuses. Guess not, huh? Actually, I just saw a big one not far from here. By the way. Did you know that cactuses have an IQ of three? Why do cactuses have an IQ three, at all? I don't right? understand. Does that mean cactuses can think? Well, it's not like researchers can test them, so it's not exactly scientific. But it is said they can talk to each other. So they're a bit savvier than most plants. That's mind-blowing. Wait a sec. Chichaki, we can't let him hear us. <laughs> okay. Why? All right. <laughs> It just stops there. Man, we're so close now. <laughs> Why? 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 What kind of conversations are we having in secret that we can't let the cactus know about? What does Ichiban want to talk Hello? about? Hello! Organic food! I have a coconut. That's why you better like it. Thanks for that. 
Aloha. Aloha. Oh god. Okay. These three performers are next level. Oh, it's the circus a run oh, for its money. Oh my god, right? you can actually get burned! Are insane. The other day, I saw this one guy juggle five knives. Jeez. One little mistake and it's game over for you. Forever. Can you do any tricks like that? Nothing remotely close to this stuff. But actually, I'm pretty darn good with a yo-yo. I can keep it moving forever. A yo-yo? Oh, nice! That's harder than it looks. Yep, I can do around Japan, and if I'm really on a roll, I can even do around Europe. Whoa. I don't know much about yo-yos, but those little things can really go places, huh? Oh, yeah. Now that I think about it, there's even a trick called Lunar Lander. Dang. Wait, another cow? There's more than one? We're really opening up. I never got good at yo-yo. I can only do like the basic up and down. Uh, but yeah, don't ask me to do more than that. Wait. Moo. Uh, um. Said Tommy's like, fuck that, nah, bro. Do a silly face. Be sad. Smile and pose. Smile. Be sad. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. There's no more conversations I can have with Chitose at the current time. Oh, fuck. Well, we can do that later. Let's go, um... I, I, didn't, I don't care about you, I wanted the briefcase. Okay, we're gonna go to the orphanage. Actual plot, because I'm running out of things to do. Which is incredible. Hey, Chichan? Yeah? What kind of person is Akane-san, anyway? <laughs> Why do you ask? Oh, uh, you know... No matter what I feel about her, Akane-san meant the world to my boss. And when it comes to him, well... He was everything I ever wanted to be. So... I guess I'm just curious what he saw in her. Okay. And we'd better find Akane-san quick. That way you can get your first impression directly. The last thing I want to do is put thoughts in your head. Is that True. How it works? That's how it works. That is how it works. Must be nice, though. What is? Wanting to see your mom, despite not knowing how to feel. That's more than I could ever say about mine, let alone my whole family. Is that right? Oh, hey, I think we're here. The orphanage. Ah, oh, check it out. It's the flame of folly. Wait. Am I tripping? Maybe I'm tripping. The symbol above the door.
I'm trying to remember the um um obviously don't answer the question but like the very first scene of the game whenever they shoot the guy in the car and they take his necklace i thought that that's the same symbol as that the the necklace had a symbol on it and i thought it was i thought it was that Kana. Kana? Yeah, you know, yeah, they're a volunteer group. Maybe I'm going crazy. Maybe, it, yeah, maybe Doing it's not kitchens. the same thing. That'd be Picking weird. Trash at the beach. Hmm. Real charity stuff. Huh. Never knew you'd be interested in volunteering. Oh, I would know. Because I showed up at their food bank one time. Really? Yeah. They gather unsold food from all the local stores, and they divvy it out to the people who need it the most. Told me you help feed the poor? I'm impressed. <laughs> Nah, man. I was there getting fed. Ah, uh, should have known. Excuse me, can I help you folks with anything? Yep. Oh, uh, yes, actually. Uh, we're here to ask about a lady named Takane. Uh, is she all right? Did you find her? That can't be good. Sorry for the outburst there. I had assumed you were with the police. No Do I look like I'm with the police? <laughs> if anything, I'm sorry I got your hopes up. Uh, let me introduce myself. I'm Dana, one of the caretakers. I've been working with Akane 20 years now. That's a long time. Yes. And for her to disappear so suddenly, it's just... Unheard of, right? When she up and disappear? As of now, uh, it's been 13 days. All she left was a single note behind, and that was it. 13 days. That lines up with what Shichan said. Yeah. Dana, what'd the note say? I resign due to unforeseen circumstances. Nothing more. Hakane's always been so responsible. I immediately thought that couldn't be right. But the handwriting was definitely hers. Did you report anything to the police? Of course. But after the handwriting analysis confirmed the note was hers, they dropped the case. We couldn't get them to look into it any further. I'm sure you've been asked this a bunch of times already. But do you have any idea where she might have gone? Unfortunately, I don't. All right. Miss Dana, you won't believe it! Yeah, the tomatoes we planted turned out huge. <gasps> oh, wow. That's so cute. I see that. Why don't you share some with our guests? Okay. Huh. Here you Look go. Look at my tomato. Wow, thanks. It looks delicious. We grow them in the garden ourselves. Huh. Um, who are they? Oh, uh, they're friends of Miss Akane's. Really? Does that mean Miss Akane's coming back? Oh, sweetie, that's still gonna take some time. Oh, how long? I really want to no. see her again. I wish I could give you an answer. Hey, I know. That's not an emblem Why thing. don't you go fetch I'm a just watermelon, <laughs> too? Find the biggest one you can. Oh, that <laughs> sounds so good. Good watermelon. Duper streams, thank you so much for the prime. Appreciate it. Enjoy your emotes. They really care about her, don't they? Yes. Akane was the closest thing to a mother these kids ever had. In fact, she may have raised over a hundred kids during her time as director. That's why people often tell her she has the biggest family on the island. That's a lot of love there. Oh, yes. She's been here 40 years, after all. 40 years? That would mean she started working here not long after leaving Japan. Right. Which is around when Captain Sawashiro met her. Did she choose to stay in Hawaii for the kids? Dana, how much do you know about Akane-san's past? Uh, her past? Well, nothing. She wasn't one to talk about herself. <laughs> 
Did she ever have problems with people, or seem like she was in trouble? I certainly can't imagine her having enemies. No one abided by the teachings more than she did. The teachings? The beliefs Palekana holds sacred. You may not know this, but fundamentally we operate as a religion. Really? I always thought Palekana was a charity organization. Charity is a key part of what we do, but our roots as a religion trace back hundreds of years on these islands. Whoa! So you guys got a lot of history then. I'd like to think so. Palekana centers its worship on Mele, a volcano goddess. Hmm. Volcanoes, huh? That's definitely something Hawaii is known for. Indeed. Volcanic activity has also shaped the fabric of our lives, especially in ages past. On one hand, volcanoes are a symbol of fear and destruction. But on the other, they represent balance and restoration. I think it's only natural to see a spark of the divine in such an awe-inspiring presence. Right. That's similar to Japan's early volcano worship, too. I guess it's universal. Seeing something awesome in nature and being inspired. Yes. And that's why we strive to coexist with nature. So that Nele might look down on us with peace. Were we to abuse her gifts? I'm fairly her certain the land that we call that home, symbol is what was on the necklace at the beginning of the game. I'm assuming that's why Palikana has the flame logo going on? That's right. Fire is a very Fairly certain about us. that. As a reminder of our faith, we always keep a fire lit, taking care not to let it burn out. Now that you mention it, I remember Akane-san had an LED candle in her bedroom. Was that a part of her faith? <laughs> I'm sure she was just being careful for a woman of her age living alone. Besides, the candle itself is only a representation. What really matters is how you tend the fire in your heart. Mm. A sacred element, huh? I is that why the kids took it slow around the candles? So you noticed. They're taught to protect the flame from when they're little. Oh. Actually, I was wondering. Why do you guys run an orphanage? That's based on another belief of ours. As a religion grounded in nature, we feel called to treat the land and those who live in it with compassion. Doing so will help the community grow and bring our hearts closer as one. And helping kids grow is a part of that. I'm impressed. We also run several other facilities, including a homeless shelter and transitional housing for families. You know, the one time I went to a Palikana food bank, it, it was real nice. And, uh, they just fed me without any preaching at all. <laughs> well, we're not in the business of preaching. So, you ask for nothing in return. Huh. Kudos to whoever's in charge. The children here seem like believers, though. Well, it's not like we indoctrinate them. We hope that by exemplifying the teachings in our daily lives, the children might see our faith in action and believe. And in that regard, Akane was unmatched. Everyone admired her for her spirit. Huh. So she was a woman of faith. Yes, and there wasn't a selfish bone in her body. All she wanted was to help the weak and less fortunate. That's what drew so many to her, and why I have a hard time believing she had enemies. And for her to just leave without a word of goodbye is just bizarre. <sighs> Dang. <sighs> Guess they don't know much more than we do. All right, Dana, we've grabbed all we can, so I'm gonna haul this over to the food bank. Hey, thanks, Callan. Any chance we can throw in some meat or fish to go with it? I wish, but I don't see any fishermen or butchers around here. Think we're good to go with what we got? Well, I guess this'll just have to do then. Mind if I ask what's going on? Oh, well, today it's our turn to donate to the food bank. We always have plenty of vegetables, but I'd prefer to offer a full range of nutrition. Akane was always the one to call up stores, and they'd bring us more than enough. 
But since she went missing, the donations stopped coming in. Aww. To be honest, I think they just liked interacting with Akane. When it's us, we don't know how or even who to ask. Aww. It's like starting from scratch. I get it. Then why don't we lend you a hand? Oh, yeah? Why not? We'll go across the island and back if we have to. Uh, that's quite sudden. Well, it's not like I want to volunteer out of nowhere. I just thought we could help people and maybe learn about Akane-san in the process. Oh. I mean, that could work. Tracing your daily routines might lead to something new. Then why not give it a shot? I don't see any other options right now. So long as we don't stir up any trouble while we're at it. We're going to stir up trouble. Of course That's not. just how it goes. We're going to give it all we got and then some. <laughs> well, you're quite the energetic one. I suppose I should take you up on your offer. Callan, would you but mind taking But that necklace that the, the guy was wearing at the beginning ah, of the game was in all. Japan. I guess maybe it wasn't. We can't really assume. We didn't get much of a... We didn't see much okay, out of that the scene. Rules are very simple. You go and collect we also don't know the time period that that scene took place in, if it was present day or like 40 years ago. Just anything you find so it really shelf, doesn't help. It has to be made in Hawaii. So only Hawaiian grown foods? Palekana stresses the importance of Aloha Aina, a love for the land and its people. Even when it comes to donations, the idea is local production for local consumption. So whether it's fish or meat, make sure they're native to Hawaii, okay? You got it. Then let's get down to work. Get down to work. Hmm. How are we supposed to collect the food? This one food bank I saw on the news, they got a bunch of leftovers from local stores. Ah, no kidding, but are any of them going to be willing to donate to a bunch of strangers? <laughs> Ah, uh, no worries there. My buddy's dad runs a fruit stand. A fruit strand? Strand. <clears throat> he must have all kinds of tropical stuff then, huh? Yeah, and he knows me, so I think he might even let us have some of his uh, unsold mm -hmm. merchandise. That'd be great. Where's this place at? Local market at Harbor Park. Leave it to me. All right. Still no sub stories popped up. Wow, we actually have to do plot. This is this is crazy. This is so weird. You know, Hawaii uses soy sauce way more than I expected. I always figured soy sauce wasn't big overseas. Pleasant surprise. Might just be a Hawaiian thing. Japanese immigrants brought it over. Ah, uh, yeah. never knew that. Uh, but then, it tastes different from Japanese soy sauce. Well, consider that its taste varies between regions of Japan as well. But you look Is it really? Kyushu soy sauce tastes sweet, for instance. Sweet soy sauce? Yeah, I was surprised too. It's used to make some stew sweeter. But mm. I now I've developed a taste for it. I even get a craving for it sometimes. Oh no, oh, no not kidding. the craving, That Kiryu. means we might get used to Hawaiian soy sauce and end up craving it too, huh? Huh, <laughs> imagine that. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, that was a lot of bond points coming out of nowhere. All right. Uh, to the park. I could have. I didn't have to walk here. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh. Aloha. Aloha. Hey. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Turn up the game a little bit. I've been playing the game at the same volume for like a week. Um, is it is it really too quiet? And you guys never told me. I'm feeling good. Soy sauce and butter mix for popcorn. Ugh, no, 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 no. I don't like the sound of that. But I can't judge too much because I probably should try it for myself before I judge it. I think I bought everything from here, or at least I thought I did. What's up? You think it's quiet too? Let's get more opinions. Because, yeah, I'm not going to do it obviously for one person. <laughs> when there are like hundreds, thousands of people watching. Oh, 
I still say Tommy's a better name, yeah? Hard to say. No comment. <laughs> Are you all friends? What brings you here today? A tad quiet game sounds fine. Sounds fine. No issues. I could make it like a tiny, tiny bit. I can adjust it like a tiny, tiny bit. I just don't want it to become overwhelming because what ends up happening is whenever the game has background music, it can overpower everything else happening if I put it up too much, which is why it's at, we're at where it's at. I, like, I gave it a slight tinge. You guys probably won't notice. <clears throat> Whoa. What you got for a quick fix? Got some grapefruit, I'll take care of that. Not like you'd have much else. But wait, actually, you do. I know something you got that'll do us one better. Money. Nothing that, nothing that blowing some cash on a couple of hotties can't cure, am I right? Wait. Empty out the register. I've heard enough of this bullshit. How about you back off? No shit, this place has got talking fruits, too? Call me a talking fruit? They're giving a shit, Tommy. Any idea what we do next? <laughs> Don't worry. This is all just a part of our volunteer totally. work. The fuck you say? You think you can bite back at the barracudas and get away with it? Oh god, this is probably a bad idea. Okay, you asked for it. It's actually better? Okay, but it was just like a very, very slight increase, but that's a... I don't want it to become too overpowering. Is this new music? I won't hold back. Oh, Barracuda have their own music? Oh, okay, Barracuda theme, gotcha, gotcha. Organization has its stooges. Idiots just like you who start thinking the gang's muscle is their own. <laughs> you don't come near this store again. Got it, brudda? Br <laughs> Kiryu is saying brudda is so fucking weird. <laughs> Starting to pick up the local language, I guess. Oh, yeah, you're picking up that local language, Kiryu. Okay. <laughs> yeah, sure. As long as they got the message. You can relax now. They won't be coming back. They've been threatening me for some time now, taking away my earnings every chance hmm. they get. Is this for the food bank? If so, by all means, let me help you out. My way of saying thanks. I got the best produce in town. Some of these I can't, eat, can't seem to sell, but they still taste... Great, of course. There's these Thanks. grapefruits too. Cotton candy grapes yesterday? Wait, cotton candy gra what? That sounds disgusting. Whoa! Finally beat the snot in a can! <laughs> Shall we have some steak tonight? That mama. Oh, and that kid sounds so good. Happy. <laughs> I can't tell you how thankful we are you came along. Just look at what your hard work has done. <laughs> and that makes it all the more worth it. Hard to see so many in need of food, though. Hurts, doesn't it? <sighs> Hawaii's inflation gets worse every year. Oh, dude, too the real! Worst of all, an average family pays 3000 a month just to live in a tiny apartment. $3,000? Dude, they are... 300,000 in yen? 
Well, back home, you could get a freaking. They are hitting on the issue. Is that for sure? A lot of people sure. have multiple jobs just to stay afloat in this economy. Whoo! Take it from me, it is rough out there. I'm barely scraping by as it is. Yeah, but not everyone's as lazy as you, Tommy. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Who says the dub ain't good? That line delivery was fucking incredible. Always had this image of Hawaii as perfect. <laughs> I guess reality hits hard, even in paradise. <laughs> Love right? that. And now more than ever, we need to put Aloha Aina into practice. That's why I do what I do at Palekana. Feeding the hungry, helping the needy. Uh, if only I could do it like Akane did. Speaking of which, how do we do? Anyone find any leads? Nope. Not on my end. <sighs> Same. I asked as many people as I could if they knew her. But all they could tell me was how nice she was. Things like that. Same here. Guess we all struck out this inning. Ah, <sighs> sorry to hear it. Kalansan. What other kind of work did Akane-san do? Well, she'd also pick up trash off the beach and then finish the night with a leisurely patrol around town. All in a day's work for her. Then can we help with that stuff too? Ooh. As long as you're cool with it. Hey, I'm cool if you are. Today we'll be cleaning Aloha Beach before sunset. We could definitely use the extra help. So if you could join the rest of our group, we'd really appreciate it. I'll come by after closing up shop here. Perfect. Then see you at Aloha Beach before sunset. You're pretty excited about all this, huh, Ichiban? I mean, isn't it nice to help others in need? Plus, we can look for clues while we're at it. What's so weird about that? Hmm, nothing, I guess. <laughs> so, Aloha Beach F before sunset. We still have daylight to burn. Maybe let's unwind for a bit. You haven't had a break since you came here, have you? Besides, if you're in Hawaii, you might as well do something Hawaiian for a change. Oh, shit. Doing something Hawaiian. You could surf. Take hula lessons. Uh huh. It'd be nice to enjoy things for a change. Like Tomizawa said, we've been running around nonstop. Let's do it. Okay. There's a travel agency over by Worldwide Market. Tourists go there all the time. I'm sure there's a lot that they can recommend. <laughs> Am I going to learn how to surf? That would be very nice. I don't see anything else that popped up on my map. There's so many icons. <laughs> so many. <clears throat> All right. Travel to the travel agency. Yeah. Are we friends? We're friends. Okay. I'm making sure that I'm, I'm making friends. I gotta max out my uh, my my social links here. Oh, dog. I'm now best friends with Ruby. Oh, Ruby gave me a plate. What a good boy. Hey, Chichan. A travel agency you were mentioning. It's around here, right? Yeah. At least, I'm pretty sure it was. Whoa. Whoa. What did you oh, run into? I wasn't looking. Uh, are you okay? Whoa. Whoa. What is this thing? Hello, happy. What? Hello, happy? Oh, are you by chance here to visit us? Huh? Welcome to Hello Happy Tours. Oh. I want to cosplay Hello that. Hello Happy Tours? I have a problem. I want to cosplay everything. Everything that, like, looks really stupid, I want to cosplay. Sorry about earlier. Alohap here should have been more careful. Uh, sure. Oh, Alohap is his name. Got it. 
That's right. He's our unmistakable oh mascot. My God, now Alan. we're being wildly unpopular. <laughs> <laughs> this guy looks like he wants to die. So he's not popular? Anyway, this is a travel agency, isn't it? Yes! This is a Japanese travel agency built and run by Japanese people for Japanese tourists visiting from Japan. Okay, that's great. Here, all our Japanese-speaking staff slave away for chunk change by preparing tours oh. and activities unabashedly geared towards oh. Japanese Oh, oh my god. <laughs> my name is Elizabeth, and I'm the manager here. Granted, Elizabeth is just a nickname. My real name is Ari Yamada. Elizabeth is based on Ari. Get it? Elizabeth. <laughs> oh my god, that's... Okay. Oh god. Wonder what their deal is. Right, well, uh, we heard about this place. Uh, well, you could help us get the full Hawaii experience. You mentioned you had some activities, right? Can you tell us more? Oh, you're interested in our activities. Well... Aloe Happy's got you covered. Whether it's shows, water sports, or just appreciating nature, we've got a volcano's worth of activities offering the very best of Hawaiian culture. Oh, those pictures look and way too good. for a limited time, your first experience is totally 100% free. That's convenient. From dorky little kids to grouchy, impatient seniors, it's a chance for the whole gang to have fun at no cost. It's your lucky day, valued customer. Oh, okay. Well, free is good. Yeah, all right. Sign free us up. Free is good. That's okay. how you get suckers. Let's get Allo happy. I hate this. Oh my god. Sign up for activities. Uh, oh, this is how you unlock jobs? Feel free to change jobs uh, you've unlocked at any Allo happy location. So there's one at the Worldwide Market, the Anaconda Shopping Center, and in Yokohama. I'm not in Yokohama. Uh, they allow the party to experience the magic of Hawaii, and who knows, maybe someone will have a revelation about a new job. Bear in mind, however, activities will require some money and depth of personality. Looks like there's currently a free promotion for newcomers. What are you waiting for? Sign up today. <laughs> Requirement, kindness level one. I think I can do that. Wow, I have, like, stats. We're doing pretty good in this game so far. Water, here we come. Yeah! Aww, that's so cute. I'm surfing? First try? Mm. I'm just swimming with a dolphin. Sir, dolphins. Yeah. Something's happening here. Awesome. And it was like uh, this revelation came to me. Like, I can take on the bad guys in a whole new way. Uh, take on the bad guys? You okay? No. Oh, yeah. It, it's hard to describe, but if I, you're I'm okay. qualified for a new job at Hello Work, it's kind of like that. Hey, I think the Allo Happy Spirit might have gone to his head, huh? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, he sounds like so, he's in constant pain. It sounds like you were inspired. I heard that can happen when you're having fun, especially when you're trying something new. And there's plenty more activities to enjoy, so don't miss out. Though we will have to charge you next time. Okay. Sure, I'll be back either way. Oh, and as an incentive to keep regulars chained to us as lifelong financial supporters, we have an Allo Happy room for you to use, free of charge. Oh, free of Allo charge. More free things. It's a private space made special for you. Use it anytime you want to change your outfit or just snag a little R&R. &R. Oh, it's pretty handy, so when you're feeling up to it, give it a try. Okay. Huh. All right. Might as well try it right now. I have two clothing 
things on here. Aquanaut job, and I'm guessing that's the Suji Mancer job. Time for a change. Uh, it's a fitting room where you can change jobs and inherit skills. All Allo Happy rooms can be found at any Allo Happy Tours location, so don't forget to stop by every now and then. Uh, okay, every ca- what is Tomi wearing? What is Kiryu wearing? Oh my fucking god. Holy shit. Every character can change jobs. Whenever you participate uh, in Tor's activity, unlock new jobs, you'll be able to change them into here as well. Into them as uh, into them here as well. Uh, you can set inherited skills from any job you've had, with the exception of the Suji Mancer. You unlock skill inheritance slots as you improve your personality and deepen your bonds. The final rainbow colored slot will allow you to set a Kiwami skill. Carry over different skills to cover your weaknesses and build the ultimate job. When a character's job rank increases, not only will the stats given by that job grow, but so will the character's own stats. The more jobs a character ranks up, the stronger they'll get. Check out the stat growth for each character in their skill pool. Uh, okay. Uh, Ichiban, you look silly. Oh god. We're doing, we're doing great. So this is a Kiwami one. Okay. Good to know. Change jobs. Today's fit. Why is the guy just standing behind me in the background? So I can be a Sujimancer. I can try this Aqua Knot job, which is honestly kind of attractive. Oh, there's even different patterns. Oh, the Yokohama outfit. Oh, I do miss, I do miss the suit. I'm not gonna lie. Ichiban's suit is iconic and I'm kind of sad we don't get to see it all game. But I feel like I gotta go with the silly. Are perfect. What matches my personality? Matches my personality. I'm not so sure about that, buddy, How but okay. To choose? Oh my god, why is Kiryu's hair blonde? Oh, honey, no. Oh, this is a disaster. Maybe it's time I change styles. I got choosy taste. Oh, Tomi's is purple. Wait, I kind of love that. I oh, have to change it literally just because it's purple. Always so hard to choose. Oh, she gets different jobs, okay. Oh, fuck me. This is... fit. I'm gonna try Suji Mancer then. Think I can pull this off? Blonde oh, Kiryu. Yeah, this is cool. Yeah. Uh, I do like tire tumbler, battery shock, boozy doozy is a good one. Hero job, so we want hero healing, hero blessing, mega swing, and I don't have Kiwami skills. I think that's fair. Okay. I need more jobs. So, how was it? Allo happy, are we? Yes, very yeah, happy. This really is handy. Consider me sold. Allo happy rooms are all over Hawaii. We have offices in the Anaconda Center and even in Japan, ready for use at any time. Well then, see you on your next adventure. I'm questioning my life so much. They're eccentric, but they sure know how to inspire a guy for battle. Anyway, I still got time to kill. Maybe not enough for another big activity, but I can at least head over to the beach. I, you know, the beach sounds nice. Wait a second. 
Oh, I meant hey. I wanted to go back in. Uh, oh, it's Allo Happy. What's up? Take one. Okay. Why do you sound so dead? Is he Allo AI? Happy presents Maybe he's a robot. Photo rally? What's this? It's an event we're hosting, like a game. You get hints that'll lead you around to take pictures. Want to try it out? Holy crap! You, you actually have a normal human voice. Duh. I only keep up that act in front of Liz. Keep my head down, sound cute, or else I get the punishment. She's scarier than she looks, man. He uh, sounds like he's always Liz, being held at gunpoint. Elizabeth? Oh, I'd really kill for a cig. Got a light? No. Uh, hey, wait a sec. How are you going to smoke with that on your head? Oh, right. There is that. <laughs> <sighs> well, all that aside, what do you think? Are you down? For the photo rally, I mean. Well, it seems nice, but we're pretty busy. We didn't exactly come to Hawaii for sightseeing, to be honest. Throw me a bone, man. Hey, you even get prizes if you take enough pics. And participation is free. Not a bad deal, you know what I mean? Not to mention the prizes are top notch. He's a low head. T-shirt with me on it, a mini me keychain, even a towel embossed with yours truly. That's incredible. Sounds I like really you're just need that. Up your extra inventory. <laughs> what a zinger! You're busting my balls here. <laughs> Please. Ah! Now I'm actually begging you. If no one shows up, this will fucking skin me alive. You don't even get me started on my paycheck. Understand? I'm desperate. Okay, fine. It doesn't like free stuff anyway, right? Might as well try. It does sound fun. Oh, God, thanks. I owe you one. I am one Allo happy guy. No, you oh, wait, aren't. So, uh, how does this work? Ah, uh, yes. Allow me to go over it with you. No. <clears throat> this will be a simple test run. Can you replicate this photo by taking a picture of the same spot? Oh. Okay, yeah, I guess I can do that. Uh, you want me to look for the place in the photo and take my own picture of it? Gotcha. We can do that. You want all the Yakuza mascots to come together like the Avengers? Bro. That would be an emblem thing. great. I'm just this and shit. That came out well. That would actually be really cool. Oh, wow, there's a lot. Oh boy. Some of these I have no idea where they are, but some of them I, I do know. What the fuck? Nailed it. Also, MK11, thank you so oh, much for the Prime sub as well. I really it. appreciate that. Just keep doing that and you're A-OK. -okay. <sighs> When you open the app, you can choose from a bunch of different subjects like you did just now. Just reference the pictures, find the correct location, and snap a pic. Once you've taken a certain number of pictures, come find me. I'll slip you some top shelf loot. Okay. Hints and rewards of photo rally spots can be checked in the photo rally app on your phone by successfully sniffing out the right spot. You'll get a stamp. Uh, okay. That's not an emblem thing. Got I'm it. just huge. And another uh, prime nine, sub. What the heck? Away. Thank you guys for the prime. Please do. Thank you, fight. And with that, have an alo happy time. This guy hates his life. Oh my god. <laughs> Great. More to do in this game. My favorite. So the sun's starting to set. Don't we have somewhere okay. to be? Let's cl go clean up Aloha Beach. That took all day. Need to slow down now. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, sign up for an activity. Well, you can't go wrong with any of these. Uh, confidence. I do have five level five confidence, and I do have that amount of money. 
sightsee throughout Hawaii, a relaxing trolley tour. The comfiest way to see the sights of the island, this laid back ride is enjoyable. Even the most sour faced samurai would wind up snoozing like babies in their sleep. That sounds terrifying. Um, become one with nature, beach, yoga, and relaxation. Seek true harmony in the most serene of settings. These yoga instructors, all former practitioners of ninjutsu, will lead you down the path to unification of mind, body, and soul, and break free of your limitations before the endless ocean. Uh, this one's cheap. If you're traveling, you can't skip shopping. A smart way to bring home memories of your trip and souvenirs for your friends at this luxurious, professionally cleaned shopping center, you can just send, spend hours browsing and buying to your heart's content. Passion level one. This is a cheap one, too. The gorgeous hula dance show. No Hawaii vacation is complete without a hula show. Performed by local artists to live to live traditional music, this must-see historical dance captivates each and every audience. Okay, let's do the cheap ones before I start shilling out a lot of money. Ooh, I want that one. Wait, okay, um... Okay, we'll do we'll do this one. We'll do the Hawaiian the hula okay. exhibition. Turned onto its own into its own series. Yeah, it definitely the, the Yakuza series definitely needed it. That's for sure. You know, it's really nice seeing Kiryu just like have a good time. Definitely the real deal. And those hips. Of course. <laughs> of course. Oh my god. <laughs> oh damn, she's a hula dancer now. Whoa. Okay. That's rad. Okay. I'm just gonna keep unlocking jobs until I run out of money. That's that's how we do things now. I could get an expensive one. So there's um parasailing experience, fire dancing exhibition, water gun shootout. Sounds fun. Um, let's get an expensive one. Do we want trolley tour or yoga on the shore? Maybe trolley tour? It says activity, wait. These are all jobs? I'm so confused. Okay, so trolley tour. I don't know what this one could be though. I'm just gonna do it. Let's all owl happy! My money is gone! <laughs> Why did I just spend all my money on this? <laughs> Let's go there. Next. No, 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 there. Uh, 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 all right, sit down. Hmm? I said that's enough. Hey, they're not bad, eh? Who knows? Maybe they'll make a living out of it. Yo, what? It's like a choke. No, bro. Bro. What? Bro? How do you get that? How did that become that? What the fuck? I didn't understand what job this was gonna unlock, and now I'm just even more confused! I can Welcome. still spend more money on jobs. What I'm not out of money interest? yet. I can spend these, like, $200 ones. Let's all owl happy. That's a stretch. It, yeah. Hey, yes, it is. This place is bopping. Sure is pretty here. Oh, I don't know where to start. 
Oh my god. No, not a maid outfit. How's that for polish? Oh no. Oh no. How many people are simping over that? All right, now I got a housekeeper job. I'm not completely out of money yet. No, I can I can buy one more $200 job. Wait, is there any $200 job? Oh no, there's that one. I can buy both of these jobs and I <laughs> I'm gonna be out of money. It's okay. I make great life choices. Have fun out there. I'm just. I was so close to spending three thousand dollars on that sub story too. I was so close, and I just burned all of my money. What the Whoa. hell? Ichiban's a goddamn ninja. You know, those moves weren't half bad. It was like, yeah, a Hong Kong action movie. It was like a Hong Kong action Okay. Okay. Aloha, I see you've really taken to the activities that we've been offering. I do hope you find them yeah. enjoyable. There sure is a lot to do in Hawaii, so it helps. Getting to run around and explore a huge island almost makes me feel like a kid again. That's great to hear. As long as you keep whipping up activities, I'll keep checking off and off off the list. On that note, see you around. His eyes, so pure and radiant with life, and such a child at heart. Wouldn't you agree, Elo Happy? Yeah. Sure. What's going on? Today is gonna be a blast. What the fuck was that? Welcome! Oh, tons of stuff to choose from! I can only afford this one now. I'm I'm broke. Have fun out there. They twirl those things? Fire dancing. <laughs> I know exactly who I want on that job. Let's give this a try. How's this? How are you meant to choose? Oh my god, no. What matches my personality? I 
I guess I gotta stick on Sujimancer. Like, we gotta try out each of them. But I really wanna try out Samurai, though. What am I feeling? Housekeeper or Geodancer for right now? What do y'all want? Geodancer or Housekeeper? Housekeeper, Geodancer, Geodancer, Housekeeper. Oh my god. You guys are not 50-50 right now. I think I see more Housekeeper. No. Oh my god. No. Y'all are actually 50-50. Okay, okay, I, okay, y'all. <laughs> oh. Chad Narukami, oh my god, hi. Love the username. One of your favorite streamers, oh my gosh. I'm honored, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I'm glad you're enjoying the videos. All right, no poll, I'm just gonna go Geodancer. I'll go Geonits. Oh, I love the fiery, on, uh, like the colors on that. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of vibing with this. Cute, no? Yeah, it's pretty cute. You wanna wear it all? Yeah, it's literally just horny and horny. Jersey you are taste. very right about that. Okay, I was gonna go with Aquanaut, but I'm tempted to see what Samurai is all about. So Tomi is gonna try the Samurai life. <laughs> Oh, I love these designs so much. Am I trying too hard? I need a makeover. I need a makeover, oh, bitch. No, so you do not. Okay, skill inheritance. Oh, wait. Aquanauts stuff. Beachside bro barbecue. Recovers HP for yourself and nearby bros. Lady bros included. With some mouth-watering grilled... Ah, awa. Okay. Enemy area, hang 10 straight into a Quimby and any along the way applying your board's attributes. The further that hoedad, the harder you'll hit them. The, the farther that hoedad, <laughs> that hoe. Break it for the spongers and may maybe increase your own agility at the time. Okay, uh, we'll stick with that. I don't need any of that. Okay, Kiryu. Um, essence of Dagger I'll keep for now, I guess. And you are fine. It'd be nice to have um, a heal, I guess. More people having a healing isn't a bad thing. Everybody has a heal. Okay, maybe that's a bit much, though. Hmm. Nah, it's fine for now. We're not doing any crazy battles. All right, now that everybody has a brand new job and I am fresh out of money, I'm literally down to eight, 189 bucks. I just spent so much fucking money. <laughs> I am, I am broke. Hi. My name is broke. I had $2,500. It's just gone. It's just gone. I blinked and my money was gone. It's great. It's a great feeling. I love that feeling so much. Hot sands, hotter yoga. Beach yoga is fantastic for the tired body and the weary soul. All you need to participate is $1,600. Yeah, let me. I'll get on that, Elizabeth. All you can eat coconut extravaganza for only sixteen hundred dollars. <laughs> That's crazy. That is this crazy, Elizabeth. That's wild. For only sixteen hundred, Allo Happy Tours Waikiki can provide everything you need for a refreshing shootout. 
Okay. I think I I'm poor. I, I don't think Elizabeth understands that I'm fucking poor now. I have no money, bitch. Jesus Christ. For 1600 bucks, you can have $20 water guns. I know, I'm getting quite the deal, aren't I? You looking for a you looking for what you were going you were going you were you looking for a fight? We're in full swing. My money is gone. I feel like I need to blame somebody for my problems to make myself feel better. Um Tell me. It's your fucking fault, dude. I, it's your fucking fault. What? Are they worshipping the sun god? Kasuga, you made it! Thanks for coming! Sure. Were you guys praying just now? That's right. We were sending our thoughts toward Nele Island. Nele Island? Uh, it's sacred land to us in Palekana. One of the small islands out there bears the name of our goddess. Legend has it, that's where Madame Nele rests her head. Ah, so is it like some kind of sanctuary of yours? That's right. It's been protected since the Hawaiian dynasties, and even today, retains its spiritual purpose when i think of the ideal life i think of being one with nature nestled in the island's untouched bounty the ideal life i guess everyone's got a different idea of luxury yeah you think however only our sage is pure enough to set foot on the island along with a select few who have demonstrated their virtue of course I've never set foot on the island myself, or even seen it with my own eyes. Maybe if I became a Haku, that would change. A Haku? Haku is a title or a role given only to those with great merit and extreme devotion. They alone can live on Nele Island, and only the sage decides who's worthy. Yeah? Well, with all the work you do, I'm surprised you're not one already. <laughs> it's very kind of you to say, but my faith is far from pure. Even my wish to become Haku is tainted with selfish desire. Ah, huh. so off the coast of Hawaii, there's a paradise waiting within paradise. You think Akane-san was trying to be a Haku? I sincerely doubt it. Unlike me, she never showed concern for herself. She hmm. never sought recognition, rewards... <sighs> None of that. In fact... What? Oh, well, this one time I asked her directly how she was able to be so kind and dedicate herself to others. What she told me, I'll never forget. She said it was her way of atonement. Atonement? For what, I wonder? Cutting out that Arakawa guy? Guess we'll only find that out in person, right? Yeah. Anyway, shall we get started on our activity? Oh, damn. <sighs> We're gonna meet Akane for, like, a sec- Okay. As if this game wasn't depressing enough. What's gonna happen is we meet Akane, like, we see each other eyes to eyes, face to face, you know. Um, and then she's gonna die like five seconds later. She's gonna she's gonna get backstabbed or something. I'd say that looks pretty clean. <sighs> Kane san sees this every night, huh? <laughs> <laughs> You done spacing out over here? Don't just sneak up on me. 
So, you find any clues? Huh? Oh, no. You? Mm, nope. All I found was the virtue of cleaning up trash. <laughs> At this rate, we'll work our way up to Haku before we ever see Akane-san. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wouldn't that be something? <laughs> hey, Ichiban. Huh? When you do meet Akane-san, say you do find out she really is your mother and all that. What then? Uh, I haven't thought that far ahead. I doubt we're gonna cry our eyes out or anything. For now, I'll hand this over. And keep the rest short and sweet. I see. I envy you, you know. Huh? Why's that? I told you about my home life, right? About my family? In my eyes, all that stuff about family, togetherness. That's bullshit. People always say your family is your foundation in life. But to me, they're a curse I can't get rid of. But you... I want what you have. To live free. <laughs> Sorry. Didn't mean to dump my personal problems on you or anything. You know, Chichan. You could always run. Uh, what? Just pack up and go. I'll even help. Trust me, I once pulled off a night flight when I was in the Yakuza. Oh, please. I thought you could tell I was being serious. And I'm being serious, too. When you say, I want to live free, I say, let's make it happen. No matter how big or how bad the Fujinomias are, then there has to be a place they can't reach. And that's where I'll take you. Remember, you saved my life. I figure it's the least I can do. Uh, um, Ichiban? Yeah? Not to be rude, but it sounded like you wanted to elope with me just now. Huh? That wasn't what I said at all! <laughs> I know, but dude, it's how you said it. <laughs> oh, F me. Oh, I should just keep my feelings bottled up inside. <laughs> First I proposed to Sacha like an idiot, and now chi gets the wrong message. Oh, damn it. Poor guy. Hey, you can stop with the pity party, okay? <laughs> Oh, sorry about that. Just falling apart at the seams. You know how it is. I really didn't mean to scare you off there. I'm not always the best talker, for sure. Even so, I want you to know I'm here for you. Please don't get the wrong idea about that. I'd love for us to stay friends, you know? Okay. Clueless can he get? Yeah? You say something? Guys, thanks a ton. Today's cleanup was a cinch with you on board. Uh, hey, happy to help. And nothing like a nice, clean beach, right? What is going on, man? <laughs> Ichiban. Uh, yeah? Thank you for that. I'm so confused. I didn't uh, think point, we'd be moving we that know fast. Next to nothing. Any tiny detail could be of help. For instance, I was thinking maybe Akane-san could have slipped onto a boat during one of these trash pickups. But then I realized the water's too shallow. Plus, there's nothing here to give you any cover. So, at least we can rule out the idea that she sailed out to sea somewhere. Wow, what a detailed thought you had. You must be a certified genius. Damn. You don't have to be an ass, you know. Let's hear what you found there. <laughs> Not much. They went around looking for things she could have dropped. But of course, that went nowhere. Same with me. I asked around, but didn't get anything useful. Callan, what was that other thing Akane-san used to do? She'd patrol the town every evening. 
Even though Hawaii is one of the safer states, it still sees its fair share of crime. What we do is check out any tourists who've been drinking or guys just hanging around. Make sure everyone's safe. Aww. Kani-san did that too? She really did, just about everything. Okay, then we know what we gotta do. We'll patrol the night away. Ho ho ho! Do I sense some enthusiasm? What? This is how I always am? Hmm. Oh, totally. Yeah. We'll step in for a Kanye's on this round. What routes do you guys usually take? Tonight, we'll be going around the Aloha Bridge and the art walls. Hmm. Huh. We'll be starting by Aloha Bridge, so you'll want to head over that way. Guy named Romero is going to be in charge. Talk to him when you want to get started. I still have some cleanup left to do, so I'll join you by the time you're at the art walls. Got mm. it. And we'll go see Romero. Oh, man. Yeah, Chitose just really fucking confused me, not gonna lie. Oh, uh, that was just... It felt weird, just because if that's what she was implying, it just feels very... fast, I guess? I don't know what to think of it. Like, I'm just kind of... I, 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 yeah, I really, I really just don't know what to think about that. It was a really nice conversation, though. It just, um, I like how much it shows just how much Ichiban is really struggling with all of this stuff happening. He's got, like, an emotional time, man. He has to deal with Kiryu's news on top of, uh, you know, dealing with all the shit with his mom and the Saiko stuff as well on the back of his mind. It's a, it's a kind of a lot to emotionally handle. All in fresh bloom. You got a favorite flower, Chichon? Hmm, what do I like? Maybe roses? Roses. Sure are classy. I've actually tried growing some, but it's really hard. They're surprisingly delicate, tricky to water, and a royal pain to prune. <sighs> you can imagine how proud I was when I finally got them to grow. <sighs> Makes me wonder if I'll ever have my day in the sun. Shijun? Oh, nothing. Just thinking aloud. Roses sure are tough, huh? Even with the barbs and beauty, they still got a struggle to the top. I think I understand a Where's the other one? Oh, it's down here. Shit. A little better now. Thanks, Jichan. Not sure you need to thank me, but <laughs> I guess you're welcome. All right. Roses. Oh, look at the yeah, bingo. The we could also we we can have a table talk with Chitose now at Revolve. Hey, a hermit crab. Wait, what? What a good deal. You can go home whenever you want. Is it really going home? It's more like lugging your whole house around. Huh? A big shell must be like a four bedroom estate. Man, you need some backbone to walk around with a four bedroom. What are you yeah, but at? imagine what it says about your crab status. Any guy with a four-bedroom shell must be pretty popular. Sorry, what exactly is a four-bedroom shell? Uh, forget it. What? This crab's a reminder to work hard and save up. In this economy, that shell's probably a rental, if anything. Oh, what true. are we talking Poor about? He inherited his shell from his rich parents. <laughs> Marine biologists don't think this deeply about crabs. Oh no, I'm dead. No! No! My segue's fucking dead and I'm poor! Anyway, crabs. Yes. Crabs are very interesting. <gasps> Cat! I love whenever cats just give me bombs. <clears throat> I know, I want to be best friends with uh, Kiryu, I really do. I would love nothing more. Hello. Hi, we're now best friends. What you look 
What you looking at, man? A chicken. Yes! Thank you, Crispy. Oh, I hate that his name is Crispy. That's such an unfortunate name for a chicken. <laughs> Genuinely, that's an awful name for a chicken. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Walking around like a poor person? I, I know, isn't that the worst? Having to walk on my own two legs because my Segway is dead and I'm poor and I can't afford a taxi. Okay, we can afford a taxi though. Whoa, killer view. We we actually can't afford a taxi. Alright, I don't see any more. Um, that's it, so plot. I'm kind of Perfect amazed we're doing so much plot. Wait, I lied. I don't want to do the plot. It's time for Sicko. Dang. Hey, I won't complain. I didn't know you were such a shutterbug. Uh, if you say so. I just feel like it's the right thing to do. We wouldn't want to save as many happy memories as possible. Especially when times get tough. Hmm, it's nice, looking back on all the fun. That, and it's easier than keeping it done. Gotcha! Now let's take a photo! You, me, Tommy, everyone. Only request, we gotta make it goofy! Deal! Then let's do, do it! Do it till we face! Thanks, Ichiban! We're really opening up! There's still one more with Chitose, but it's not on my map. Well. Came from YouTube, YouTube, and you can't wait for the Yak clips of Yakuza. Honestly, me too. <laughs> but hey, welcome to the streams. I appreciate you stopping by. Oh, I just picked up a weapon. It just occurred to me that I need weapons. Um, I have so many grass cutters. Why do I have so many grass cutters? Okay, this is my... Okay, combat sword. Right. I have so many. Why do I have so many? Uh, okay. Oh, I can set my Sujimon here. Wait a second. What? Wait, I need exterminator coon. Oh, the drunk guy. Yes, bitch. Squirmworm and Adam. Oh, yeah, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Oh, which one do we want? Wells, this guy? Good thing I, I totally forgot to set the Sujimon. Thank you for chilling as always. Let's get serious. Okay, okay, we're gonna play the sicko snap. Because I didn't try the hard mode yet. Wish I could catch a baseball game in person sometime. Beer and a late night game. That's the best. <laughs> Isn't baseball better on the TV though? You get the commentary and stuff. Oh, you don't understand. Nothing is better than seeing it right. I agree. I really Ichiban, like baseball. Stadium, right? Not telling. I know that's a really <laughs> unpopular opinion. Everyone gets fucking bored of baseball. Uh, stadium. I'm with you all the way. Uh, stadium, I guess. Stadium. Hearing the crack of the bat with your own ears, it's like a festival. The kind of experience you only get in person. Yeah. You know, that's a man after my own heart. Yep, well, yep, yep. Probably. Stadium oh, all the way. That's how it is. The way you put it, baseball it games at a stadium. Go. No, I love it. But I've never been to a stadium. I wouldn't know how to act. This girl. <sighs> I'm taking all of you with me next. <laughs> this day. freaking Show girl. Show you how to have a great time. <laughs> Lucky, that's my ticket paid for. Oh! How soon into this conversation were you planning that? Oh my God, no. girl! She planned that. She's a witch. Hello. Hey. All right, Ralph, you're my buddy now. 
All right, I really want to play Sicko Snap, so we're going to play Sicko Snap. I didn't try the hard mode yet, so we got to try it. Play Sicko Snap. It's raining degenerates. Oh, God. 50 Sickos. Oh, my God. The last one had 30. Kose's on a grind? She do be, man. I forgot how to take pictures for a sec. came out real nice shots came out real nice I love just getting crotch shots Good enough for oh me. no I took it too early he jumped oh he's a he's a onomichio I need to step it up shots came out real nice Good enough for me oh fuck shots came out real nice Good enough for me oh my god there's so many Came out real nice. Oh, Jesus. Whoa! Zooming on by, man. Shots came out real nice. Good enough for me. Good enough for me. Damn, look at them lounging like that. Shots came out real nice. What Shots the hell? He's nice. spinning. Oh, Lord, he's spinning. Better next time. Oh. Good enough for me. Shots came <laughs> He's out just real chilling nice. in the truck. Shots came out real nice. Good enough for me. Nice chest shot. Shots came out real nice. Came out real nice. <laughs> Shots came out real nice. Good enough for me. Good enough for me. I don't know where to look. Oh, Shots came out real nice. Oh, no, I missed him. Could have done oh come on! Shots came out real nice. Good enough for me. Oh ass shot, nice. Shots came out real nice. Good is he grinding me. on the window? And that police is not acknowledging it. Okay. Could have done better. No! I need to step it up. I need to step it up. Oh Good no! Better. I need to step it up. I can't. Oh my me. god. Oh my god, this is a disaster. Nice. And me. he's playing the ukulele up there. Shots came out real nice. Good enough for me. Shots came out real nice. Not too shabby. Oh come on. Came out real nice. And the police is chasing him. Picture perfect. Good enough for me. Shots came out real nice. Is that it? It seems like Where are that. You hiding? Oh. Oh Good my god, the me. cops caught up to one. I don't. I don't see any. There's just that last guy. Got some great shots. Oh boy, that was that was a first try, that's for sure. I think I could be satisfied with ending the stream like that. Um I don't think I can get any better than just ending it on a note like that. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for stream and have a great evening, okay? I will save. I'll probably do some Sujimon off stream. But yeah.
Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Have a fantastic evening, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, everybody!